chat uh the, we're gonna be doing something i we markiplier you're right you're right i'm not markiplier. he's not markiplier chat don't let him lie to you i'm not, I'm not gonna hold yourselves in a higher standard than that i'm not gonna do this bit where i'm just like markiplier hello, hello everybody my name is markiplier hello everybody my name is markiplier imagine if markiplier yo new slay the princess game. merch yeah uh they, they got like shirts and stuff a shirt. <laughs> they have a yeah. shirt and posters. They got shirt. They got post. I'm hoping that we like get makeshift plushies or something soon. I'm oh my god, a makeshift that. plushie of the princess would be really funny because then I can stab it. That is so true. Are you able to like stream on Discord too? By the way. Uh yeah, I can do that. All right, awesome. Chat. This is an unpredicted uh thing. We're streaming with uh Dave. Yeah, that's me. I'm Dave. Yeah, that's Dave. Chat, say I, hi. I say hi to Dave. Dave. He's the guy who knows more about this game than I do. Yeah. Uh, t -t 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 -t. Let me. Switch. I mostly I mostly ask because I'm all, I'm also like going to draw some stuff like Based? for a game I'm making. Based. So yeah. That has nothing to do with my stream. Uh, ban. <laughs> <laughs> true. True. Nothing to do with my stream. Therefore, ban. Absolutely. Capture specific window. Why don't you capture see the slay the princess? There we go. Yes, there we go. Perfect. And now transition. I will I will let you know this is like it's not like a super big update. Like it like No, it's like, like a it, it like yeah. adds new music, yeah. It adds a bit. It adds like a bit more like music. It Shut up! I'm gonna I'm gonna read this. Shut up! I'm gonna read this. Whatever horrors you may find behind these dark spaces, have heart and see them through. There are no premature endings. There are no wrong decisions. There are only fresh perspectives and new beginnings. This is a love story. Hopefully, my audio mixing has gotten. Hopefully, my audio mixing has gotten better. So hopefully, I'm not quieter than the game. Did you, like, uh, mess with the audio? No, it's just, uh, this microphone's better, and I and I just had them both at, like, set That's, values. That is true. You might want to, you might want to, uh, like, do something about the audio in, like, this stream. Uh, Wait, stop yeah. talking for a second? Okay. No, the audio's fine. I'm louder than the audio. You're louder than the audio. It's fine. Good. It's just, I was, I was really open. quiet that stream. Hello, Mumther. Yeah. Hello. Um, new game. Chapter 1, The Hero and the Princess. Thanks for the hydrate when I have no water. You're on a path in the woods. Alright, I guess right, I'm gonna... That path she's gonna leave the narrator in suspense while I and fill up my jug. Jug, jug, when you... Alright, fellas. It's, this is like one of those games. So, Slay the Princess, right? It's essentially like slaying a princess. Your whole task is that you are Mr. Princess Slayer and you must murder. And the narrator guides you. He's like, you're on a path in the woods. And at the end of that path is a cabin. And in the basement of that cabin is a... <laughs> a princess. A princess. That's what that... Saw the video. Did... Shut up! up okay dj please like come on come on man come on come on you can't be you gotta be joshing yeah. man fun fact i edited that video i made the video i, I made it all by myself i edited it i'm not joshing i'm john Fuck, dude, you're right. 
Now uh, whatever, I'm gonna continue drawing this while I wait for Abby to get back. Has chat been bullying you? Yes. <gasps> yes. Very much stretch. so. How's chat bullying you? I was explaining the game and DJ was like, um, we saw the video. Well, I mean, he's the mod and you aren't, so. You're right. You're right. You're on path in the you're woods. here to slay her. If you don't, it will be the end of the world. Will it now? That's crazy. Um. <laughs> oh, okay. Thanks for telling me what to do. It's all part of the job. Um. You make your way up the short path to the cabin. You'll find the princess with parallaxing. Parallaxing. I'm sad I missed the full stream last time, but now, now I get to see the woman. I'm gonna the try woman, it. The woman. No, it's it's the same woman. <laughs> I mean, technically it is, yeah. I have to try and avoid the paths I've already been down. Yeah, do you need, do you need my help? Uh, no, I, I no, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. All right. We'll save okay. before each one. If we get one that we've seen already, we'll, we'll, we'll go back to the save. I will oh, say there are some- Before you go any further. That are like in the same path, but delve deeper into it or split off from it. Yeah, yeah, there are several that you can like delve deeper into. I'm sure. Like, the ghost one, instead of letting her inhabit my body, I could probably take the knife or something. You'll see. She will lie, she, she will cheat, cheat, and she will do everything, everything in her power to stop you from slaying her. Don't believe a don't word, believe she, a word says. she says. Yeah, yeah, whatever, We're Brit. Go through with this, right? She's a princess. We're supposed to save princesses, not slay them. There is one that I want to do. There is one that I want to do that I didn't delve into when I, when I did the stream for the video. Oh, him. He doesn't know what yeah. he's talking about. The, the, I just want to make you happy. I just want to make oh, you right. happy. I just want to make you happy. The damsel, yeah. The interior All of right. the cabin um, is almost entirely. Save over this. Yes. Narrator. Oh, that's the log. Okay. I want to s s A, the princess. Auto, skip, auto. Here we go. The blade is your I don't know what you just said. You'll need it if you want to. He wants to slay quick. the princess, but the S is in parentheses. Um, enter the basement. I don't need a blade. I can do it Homer Simpson style. The door to the basement Hell creaks yeah. open. Just like the video! That's the last trick! Holy shit! Dave, shut the fuck this up. <laughs> That's stupid. I don't think you deserve your human rights anymore. The princess really lives here. Slaying her is probably doing her a favor. Oh fuck! Hold up, I'll be right back. Softly carries up the stairs. Oh, this is gone. Voice. Hello? Is someone there? This hypnotizing. It's the kind of voice you only have to hear once to remember it for the rest of your life. Mm-hmm. Don't let it fool you. It's all part of the manipulation. You're playing a dangerous game by coming here unarmed. Hi. Don't be a stranger. It's been so long since I've had any visitors. Please, come downstairs. Okay. You walk down the stairs and lock eyes with the princess. There's a heavy chain around her wrist binding her to the far wall of the basement. She's beautiful. How could someone like this be a threat to anyone? I am begging you to stay focused. There's a lot riding on you here. Hi. Do you think you can get me out of these chains? I am begging you to stay focused, you little buzzard bugger. <laughs> 20 day streak? Congrats on the 20 day streak. Yo, Holy shit. Thanks. 
a true a true viewer in chat. Hello. Hello. Hopefully you guys saw the new video on Slay the Princess. Uh, I said we would stream this on that day. And we are. Oh, I just noticed there's feathers in the uh, in the in the selection box. This is a devoted yeah. viewer right here. Hell yeah. And it's that also is. the long dark. I didn't notice that till light. watching the video. Hell yeah. Uh, hold on, let's talk a bit first. I want to. I'll see what I can do. Uh, I'll see what I can do. You're only making this more difficult. She's so pretty. <laughs> you. Add that to the counter. Thank you. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Okay. Uh. Okay. Dave told me this while he was editing the video. Uh, drinking game. Take a shot every time I say she's so pretty. Thanks, DJ, for saying it, too. You're gonna die. You're gonna die. You're gonna die. You know? You're gonna need to get your stomach pumped by the end of the night. For real. You're making a huge mistake. Not really. No. You're doing the right thing. You walk up to the chains binding the princess to the wall. Chat, you can't just like, say so what I say. Dave, I suggest opening chat. Yeah, I see chat. Perfect. Don't do a water drinking game, either. God damn it, Dave. <laughs> heavy. Far too that can also be dangerous. True. Trying to break them apart. Instead, drink raw sriracha. I'm guessing you don't have the key? No. Maybe it's somewhere upstairs. Doubtful. Whoever locked the princess away down here intended for her to never see the light of day. They wouldn't have just left the key to her chains somewhere in the cabinet. And if there isn't a key, do you have any other ideas? I'm going to check upstairs. Maybe the key's still lying around somewhere up there. And if not, maybe I can at least find something to break you free. Okay. I'll be here. Good luck. Thank you. You attempt to make your way out of the basement, but the door at the top of the stairs slams shut. You hear Bitch. click of a lock. Motherfucker. Into place. Is someone else here? Narrator. Narrator. I, mean, I, I gotta stop like like referencing. The stop referencing again. my video. You're gonna make it harder to turn this into a video. Yeah. You're only you're making this harder for yourself. Stairs. This would have been so much easier if you'd just taken the blade like you were supposed to. Yep, yep, yep. Easier yeah, for yeah. whom? Easier for everyone. Look at the mess you're in. How can I be in a mess? There's a beauty right here. Can y'all not see my pointer? I probably need uh, to turn on I, the pointer. I don't think you can. No, you I can. can. I have capture cursor off. There we go. See? Chat can see my cursor. Coochie, coochie, coo! <laughs> I love doing that with the stupid finger pointer. Yeah. Abby, should I tell him? I heard the door slam. They locked you down here too, didn't they? Yeah. Tell, tell, tell me path. what? Rising in the princess's voice. No, they're talking to the other chat member. Oh. <laughs> There's a slight panic. If I could just get out of these chains, I know we could force our way out of here together. Oh, I should probably mention, uh, gore warning for the entire stream. Your only warning is now. She barely hesitates. As, uh, as she her bites arm her arm off. Her teeth There's like a particularly gory moment that if you end up in it, I will warn you. Is it the... No, is, well, that that is actually pretty gory, but there's another especially so, so, so moment. As she rips her flesh from her bone, a sound comes from behind you. The clang of bouncing metal. It's the, the knife from upstairs. You're not sure how it made its way down here, but if there's a time to strike, it's now. <clears throat> or we could use it to free her. You won't like what happens if you do that. Save the princess. Fine. Against your better judgment, you place the blade against the ragged, self-inflicted wound on the princess's arm, just above the unyielding chain. Girl, you got some ketchup place. on your lip. It you is ketchup. Into her Don't flesh. worry, YouTube, it's ketchup. There's no YouTube. The blade is sharp, and it takes oh, true, YouTube isn't real. The bone of her arm. Don't worry, her Twitch. Her Twitch. That's, that's ketchup. Twitch don't care. The chains follow oh, suit. She didn't so much as utter a sound through the whole ordeal. No, she didn't. She smiles softly as her gaze meets yours, blood from her wounded arm dripping rhythmically to the ground. How is she still smiling after everything? It's like she isn't even bothered by what just happened. Thank you. Now let's get out of here. 
approach the locked door. No, we won't have any of that. The, the narrator. You can't just Not again. The world. No, I can't just let her escape into the world. This motherfucker. I hate him. Says, no. Your body steps forward and raises the blade. Yeah, speaking of hating characters, uh, this is. Don't you remember how this route contains one of your favorite uh, voices? Oh, God damn it. You could have you could have made me remember he exists at the time he exists and then I would have had a better reaction. This isn't fair. You can't just do that. <laughs> Chat's figuring out that I knew that I could spare Starlo in the last stream. <laughs> Watch me. What the fuck you killed him? I killed all the bosses. I pretended it was an actual RPG. <laughs> They're calling me horrible. <laughs> Uh, warn her. Uh, listen, as the as a Texan here, I'm like, that's deeply offending. Listen, he's alive. I reset. No, it's isn't. okay. Yes, he is. I he's alive. Is. I reset. You, you know you don't have to do this, right? Your body lunges forward, the blade held low, ready to sink into her heart. But the princess dodges, stumbling back against the wall before the blade has a chance to connect. Stop it. Stop trying to resist me. I'm trying to get you out of here alive. Some mod called red and yellow. Is that like a multiplayer oh. mod? Resist. The blade. Move the blade. As your body remains frozen in stubborn resistance, the princess takes a cautious step forward. Why does he say it like that? The princess. The princess. We both know this isn't you. She nervously reaches towards you and takes the blade from your infuriatingly rigid hands. What are you doing? Oh, shit. I'm sorry. I'll try to be quick. She plunges it into your chest, tearing through flesh and sinew. It is agony. Yeah. You aren't dead Sh yet. Shut the fuck up, Dave. I'm trying to play the video game. Oh, no. I'm so sorry. Stay strong. We can tough it out until it's done. For her sake. For her sake. Don't Where are the voices coming from? That dying a painful death is some sort of and heroic gesture. The two of you have literally do You're schizophrenic everyone. in this game. Yeah, in this game, I'm schizophrenic. Not the narrator, but like the hero voice. He just kind of appeared. Whatever. Yeah, no. She sinks the blade into your chest again and again and again, and you feel every inch of burning pain that slices its way into your body. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. She doesn't know how to use a knife, does she? Apparently not. Though it doesn't matter how sloppy her knife work is, does it? A stab wound I like is that I can... a stab wound, and it won't be long before you bleed out. I'm happy that I don't have to voice any of these characters. They can voice themselves, and it makes me... It, it, For real. My For throat real. thanks this game. That's why I can never play visual novels. Well, if I'm playing a visual novel by myself, which is rare, but it happens every now and then. Not all stab wounds are made equal. <laughs> With one last thrust of the knife, your legs give out beneath you. You collapse to the floor, your blood pooling around you, your limbs unresponsive. The princess stares down at your ruined chest as tears carve rivulets of pink down her blood. Rivulet? Rain world reference? Ruffles? It can't just end like this, right? Kira, why are you complaining? I was playing a pseudo visual novel earlier. You mean Ace Attorney? Oh, that's rich coming from you. As much as I prefer, I feel like he's like gone different. I don't, I don't think he likes the feeling of what's being happened. stabbed multiple times. I don't know. Have you made your choice. It's over. Everything goes dark. And you die. And you die. The damsel. Where's the N in that in that letter? There's supposed to be an N in damsel. You're on a path. You're here Damn to damsel. I'm getting terrible since it was has already happened. Proceed to the cabin. I'm not trusting oh, Abby for now. Thanks for telling me, DJ. The right side is I can now make Undertale jokes. Holy shit. Yeah, uh, sorry about that. 
We are gonna play pacifist though. I really do. I really do want to fight Soroba again. Cheat. If only you. Ah, I'm Excuse skipping me. his dialogue. I don't like him. Forget. But he yeah, he's awesome. last time. What are you talking about? I think he's like one of one my favorites. Course. I don't. I fucking hate him. He's annoying. Why do you? Why do you? He, he's annoying. He's I annoying. miss our he's hero. Awesome. I I miss our woman. He's he is like a Twitter user trying to pretend like he cares about women. That's my no, voice. I don't care. Doesn't. Your voice is annoying. <laughs> yeah, pacifist ignores Starlo. The I'm not gonna kill Starlo. Starlo's fine. Voice of the smitten. I fucking hate Smith. I do. Sure. Shut up. <laughs> yeah, your passions are strong and all, but not everyone needs to hear them. Some things are better kept quiet. Don't pay their bickering any mind. Focus on the task ahead. Proceed. He's got the most dynamic voice. You got, you got at least like, <laughs> for my editing's sake. Clean and elegant. No, I'm skipping all of his dialogue. Fuck you. Man. A prison befitting a royal prisoner. Abby, I'm ignoring my responsibilities for this stream. Turn off the stream and get your shit done. The blade is your implement. Uh, enter the basement. You better let me hear this voice. Fine. Fine. The door to the basement creaks open, revealing an intricate stairwell. Gold-trimmed carpet glimmers in the light of the torches positioned along the walls. The basement almost seems welcoming in the dim firelight. It's only ten pages in two days. I'll be fine. Bitch! You better get five pages done before the end of the day! <laughs> Damn. I will this not have you fail your damn class. But it's still a stone basement. If the princess lives here, slaying her is probably doing her a favor. A soft voice carries up the stairs. Hello? Is someone there? Her voice. It's somehow even more beautiful than last time. I think we're in love. Okay, I'm with you that we should be doing whatever we can to save her, but saying we're in love is a bit much, don't you think? We don't much do you hate this princess. Man. We can still do right by her without all this fawning. I wish I could remove him from the game. Uh, how much do you, like, would you want to, like, break his heart? Yes. Are you, are you down to murder for that? <laughs> I don't have the knife. Yes, you for you everyone's can, you, you'll sake, have the opportunity. not in love. <sighs> Just remember that her charms are all part of the manipulation. Also, no spoilers, Dave. You walk down I'll the stairs spoil it. I'll just, I'm just saying. The princess. There's a heavy chain you can break his heart. Wrist, binding her to the far wall. My love, we're here to rescue you from your unjust He really does sound like Matt. Imprisonment. He does. Indubitably. Two buttons! You know she can't hear you, right? <laughs> did someone say buttons? I did, did someone say the princess? I love the princess! Fuck, <laughs> I opened up DaVinci Resolve. <laughs> I didn't mean to open up DaVinci Resolve. I gotta close it, I gotta close it. <laughs> did someone say princess? I love the princess! <laughs> <laughs> she may not be able to hear my words, but surely... She can hear. Oh, your spirit's plenty loud, all right. So, Chad, I like this fun, line. Little, yeah, fun, fun you, facts, Chad. A uh, little uh, editing so behind the scenes. I I had to like down all of the audio for like whenever the the game was speaking, uh, and I really wanted to make it so like that line in particular is just like not edited, so that way. Chat, you have me to thank for not rupturing your goddamn eardrums. <laughs> gonna be like loud she as shit but... and she called us a hero flattery really goes a long way with the two of you doesn't it waiting for you to come back you've been here before haven't you that's right villain it's the princess that's right villain <laughs> well she killed us only because he made us try and kill her it was self-defense our beloved's hands remain unstained by cruelty. Abby, is it wrong to say I can fix her? There's nothing wrong with her right now. <laughs> yeah, she's like, she's fine right now. This is the, the most calm you're gonna see this woman tonight. To oblivion. 
I'd really hoped I'd be the first, but what's done is done. What matters is you have a chance to do it right this time. We damn the whole world. But what? everything reset. Don't worry about it. I know, but I mean the other version? Like the knife hand one? Oh, you mean the uh the scissor? The Is that her name? The razor. The razor. No 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 no, no. not resetting again. <laughs> Nothing resets. You're just somewhere else. You can't keep hopping between worlds forever. That's traumatized. <laughs> that was a reference. No. It's not an Undertale reference. This is horrible. Fuck, I forgot to make it. He's so static. Fuck. Undertale. Undertale. I love that game. Undertale. I love that game. That's awesome. I hope you I hope you guys know with Matt Pat being in the FNAF movie there is a direct link between there's an indirect link between Undertale and FNAF. It's a lot more direct than you think because he is named Ness in that movie. I know, that's what I'm saying. Specifically because like, But on, that's okay. only if the FNAF if that theory is in fucking in the FNAF lore. If that specific theory is in it. No, oh, it was an ISAT reference. Okay. No, you see, I didn't know because resetting is the term for Undertale and looping is the term for ISAT. Horrible for you, maybe. God damn it. We've been given I forgot about Smitten. ...to sweep her off her feet and treat her like the lady she is. Now, hold on. If she actually ended a world, are you sure Shut up, Hero. saw a world end? Shut up, Smitten. He's lost it. I want it for myself. This is his fucking <laughs> shut up voices. I'll kill you. <laughs> calm, calm down, <laughs> calm down, Dark. We're your friends. Shut up, voices. I'll kill you. Touches the mirror. <laughs> 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 oh, I'm getting lightheaded, fuck. Oh, we gotta stop. <laughs> you guys. Oh, that was good, that was funny. <laughs> Shut up, voices, I'll kill you. <laughs> uh, I'm saving that as a clip. For real. Just do your job. You killed me last time and it hurt a lot. Why'd you do that? I didn't bring a knife. Um, rescue the princess. Rescue her? What are you talking about? Did you forget that she's a world-ending monstrosity? And even if you wanted to unleash her onto the world, despite the complete moral disaster that would be, you'd have to get her out of those chains. Good luck with that. I think you doubt the amount of uh, sympathy the smitten has for Don't this woman. Don't you see how dainty her hands are? We'll be able to slip her out with ease. No, she's a prisoner here. You can't just slip her hand through the chains. If her hand could just slip out of the chains, why hasn't she done it already? Because we've yet to present her with her freedom. I think the smitten might be uh, misogynist. Just a little bit. I don't know. That's, that's because he because he said fucking. Um, I remember the last time I played this, she, he said she's perfect because she wants to do nothing but make us happy. And I'm like, that's not, that's not healthy. That is I'm not sure I follow. Thing. Would you rather believe me, a passionate heart guided by love and my own good nature? Or would you rather believe the devil on your shoulder who tells you what you can and cannot do? Bitch, you're telling us what to do. <laughs> I think I'd rather believe in facts. Yeah, I'm with the hero on this one. I'm with Hero from Dragon Quest XI on this one. Ah, so you're one of those... <laughs> the hero who tells you to kill yourself. <laughs> oh yeah, new Rain World DLC announced? I know, I'm so happy Nightcat hasn't been forgotten. One of us has to be. Then let me show you this a brand new truth. Is. Narrator, we courageously step forward and free our beloved from her bindings. No. 
I can't let you do that. If you take another step towards the princess, I'll... You'll what? Take over our body and force us to try and kill her? I would if you had a weapon. Not on my watch, villain. My passions contain titanic depths, and if you try anything that might harm our dearest, I will end our life without a second thought. Damn, this man really is a simp. He really I is. wouldn't. You wouldn't. You doubt me. I would. <laughs> I'd listen to him if I were you. He has a lot of strong feelings. And doesn't the world end if we don't stop her? <sighs> you approach the princess and gingerly slide her hand from her bindings. That shouldn't have worked. I'll be damned. We're doomed. Hey, babe. Kiss me on my be on my beak, baby. Give me, give me a good old passionate mwah, right on the beak, right How there. How kissing work with like a beak? Do I have a beak? Does the long dark have a beak? You can just call him the protagonist, but like. Uh, I don't want to call him the protagonist. That's not his name. That's dead naming. I don't want to dead name him. Sure. Fair, fair. Uh, he does have a beak. Uh, in the in one of the Yo, scenarios. Yo, puppy girl you... ether. Thanks for the follow. Hell yeah. But, but yeah, in one it. of these scenarios, I guess I have to. with the adversary, oh, the, shit. you can see a beak on the wall after she fucking, oh, wait, I shouldn't say. Ah, uh, okay. I told you, there's no life more worth living Furries than that. Furries have found the answer? Believer. Arthur Morgan says simpleton. It's fucking Red Dead Redemption with this guy through and through. I'm free, and you're not trying to kill me this time. Donna, it wasn't Thank my you. fault. Thank you so much. The princess jumps <gasps> Hug! and smothers you in a joyful Hug! <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Dave. Oh, the narrator hates love. He went, Ew, ew, yucky, ew, yucky. Christine Blade would be buried in her back and everyone out there would be saved. Hello, how are we doing? Yo, Goofy's Goober was popping. Luckily for Hell Mr. Yeah. Romance, we don't have a weapon. Who needs a weapon when we have the power of love on our side? What do we do now? Uh, what do you want to do? Yes, end the world. Spoken with the rank cynicism of someone who has never felt love in his heart. Hey, wait a minute. Why is his a capital H? Uh, it's meant to. It's meant to like always refer to the narrator. To the narrator. Uh, I guess that makes sense. Like how he, with a capital H in the Bible, is always God. I am looking respectfully. We run away, run away, Tootie Bimbo. Don't call her a bimbo. Fuck. I don't actually know. Nobody's ever asked me what I wanted before. She doesn't even know what she wants. You may have had it all wrong. What if this whole thing is just a misunderstanding? What if she doesn't want to end the world? You're so gullible. It's the only thing you've ever doubted, the actual truth. Me when talking to flat earthers. <laughs> me when talking so to true. me when so talking true. to my coworker when he says Corona isn't real and I'm like motherfucker I got infected twice. Are you are you a bimbo? No, because I'm not a woman apparently. I what think the fuck? I want to leave. Who said that? And I think the princess closes her eyes in deep reflection and then she shrugs. You scatterbrained bimbo buffoon. Damn, chat just got allowed a new word to say and now they're just spamming it. <laughs> I should have denied the use of bimbo. We can do so many things and we choose to start talking with our multiple personalities. I don't know. What do you want to do? I want you to tell me what you want. I just want to make you happy. She can't just want to make us happy. It makes sense to me. That's all I want for her, so of course she'd want the same for us. There must be something you I want. I just want to make you happy. Oh, she's getting simpler. Broken? You, you sure you want to go down this route? Or? I'm going down this route. What's going on? I... She's lying to you. Only she isn't a good liar. Are you starting to trust me now? But what would make you happy? I just want to make you happy. <laughs> Question mark? What is happening? This isn't right. I don't know what's going on, but this isn't right. Stop staring at me with them big old eyes. <laughs> <Girl>. <laughs> That's still an 8 out of 10. I don't see the problem here. She's just sweet on us. You don't have to act like it's a big deal. Would? 
You have to want something more than just making me happy. Okay, I'll find something else to want if that makes you happy. Is it just me, or does it feel like we're alone right now? And they lived happily ever after. It's all she here. wanted. Oh, shit. That's an ending? Bye. Yeah. DJ really is that one gif? Oh my goodness gracious. Oh shit, I gotta narrate now. <clears throat> you don't get the chance to ask another question. Something has taken her away, and it's left something else in her place. No. She was our perfect match. She's gone. W where did she go? Should we try and find her? And is that a mirror? Why is it here? Why now? Approach the mirror. I'm begging you, don't do this. Ignore him. This, this doesn't feel right. It feels different, final. Yes, I fear that we won't like what we'll see. What if we just sit here and preen for a while? That can't hurt, right? The voices feel small, distant as you approach gaze into my reflection. Silence as you reach forward. They're gone, but the mirror remains. It's time for you to see what's in it. It's you. You are alone in a place that is empty. It is quiet here. You are at the cabin. Something finds me in the long quiet and brings me the gift of a fragile vessel. Yeah, this is why I was like, oh, are you sure you want to go down this route? The gift of a fragile vessel? Yes. Nerves and fibers to feel the world's beyond. Perspectives to make my own. This one is soft and delicate. He molded her to love you, and she'll make for a gentle heart. Do not mourn her. She has served her purpose. Do we know each other? You are familiar, but you are not me. I feel sadness, longing, hope, as I witness you. What happens now? Nothing, as we are. But I know that there are worlds beyond us, and that we are meant to reach them. There is no exit, but this vessel is a creature of perception. She can make you forget, if only you believe her to be able to. Bring me more perspectives, so that I may be whole, and perhaps then we will know our freedom. I love this game, by the way. Make me forget. She asks that <clears throat> I tell you to remember her. I won't. You Everything goes dark, and you die. Bring the deconstructed damsel to her. You're on a path in the woods. You're here. I don't care. No, you Attention. can skip previously seen dialogue by hitting the tab on your keyboard or RI on your controller. R1. Oh, that's what that was. Oh, that's what that was. What? I, I was playing this originally. Mm -hmm. uh, like a new game and I was like skipping through the dialogue and then like a little like bit of text appeared and I'm like oh fuck is this like the 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 fucking the the, the shifting mound like, thanks talking? for the hydrate chat up oh, there back <sighs> uh turn around and leave Seriously? you're just going to turn around and leave do you even know where you're going 
quietly continue down the path away from the cabin. Huh. I suppose you just quietly continue down the path away from the cabin. Good. What we're being asked to do here is wrong. Better to wash our hands of this whole situation than to take part in it. Ignore that annoying little voice. He doesn't know what he's talking about. That was more than me. That's strange. It looks like this path... <laughs> Turn around and again and leave. Again. You're really keen on wasting everyone's time, aren't you? It's remarkably selfish, if you ask me. I've already out... Good! Maybe everyone should die. It's what they get for dumping me in the woods and asking me to kill someone for them. When I said everyone, I meant everyone. That's a pretty large group to just condemn to death over a single princess. And, last I checked, you're part of everyone too. So if you think about it, walking up to that cabin and slaying her is really in your best interests as well. Fuck. But fine, you turn around and trek back down the path you came. Where is the hot oh, woman? You look at that. You're at the cabin again. Now, I'm not normally one for superstition or astrology, but I have to say, it seems like the universe itself is doing its best to bring you to your fated confrontation with the princess. <laughs> You're watching your stream. <laughs> There's no fighting us, is there? I have to go in the cabin if I don't. Oh, yeah? Well, I guess I start walking in a different direction again. In fact, I'm going to just keep trekking through the wilderness until I find a way out There's of this always place. A choice. Let me tell you right now that you're making the wrong one for pretty much everyone who's ever lived, as well as for everyone who ever will. And here we go. As you trudge into the woods, something strange starts to happen. At first, it's little flickers out of the oh, corner of your wow. eyes. This is new. Glimpses of familiar wooden structures through the leaves. But as you focus on your surroundings, you start to realize that those flickers weren't just a trick of light. That's creepy. In every direction, uh -oh. there is a Sands undertale and a cabin. Shut up! And not just a cabin. The cabin. An infinite fractal of paths and cabins desperately trying to draw you back to where you need to be. Wait, what's going on? You're too stubborn for that, aren't you? It doesn't matter how many paths or cabins appear around my you. Friend, I told my friend that I'm on a live stream. Your responsibility because you care more about irritating me than you do about the fate of the world. Go on. I, I told my friend I was uh, live on stream and, and then they just said, Say a slur, say a slur, say a slur. No! <laughs> you, you know that, right? That one TF2 clip. Oh, you like my Twitch? certain death. You lose track of just how long you spend aimlessly tromping through the wilderness. But it's not like any of that time spent lost in the woods really matters, because it isn't long before the world ends and everyone dies. Chapter 2, The Stranger. God damn it, just like in Lethal Company. You're on a path oh. in the woods. And at the end of that path is a cabin. Whoa. And in the basement There's a wall, cabin, hold on. Is a princess. Oh, shit. You're here to slay her. If you. I'm getting her since debut. It's already happened. Okay, no, you aren't kidding. She actually ended the world last night, didn't she? What the hell is she? Oh, you bastard. You're in for it now. I'm wise here, tricks. But I died. The whole world ended. What am I doing here? Those walls weren't here last time. You can't just force me to go what to the cabin. What are you talking about? I'm sure those walls have always been there. It makes sense if you think Sure, they've been there. The <laughs> Guess, lady. Lost. Or. Heaven forbid, someone other than you might have stumbled onto the princess. If he doesn't remember what happened, then maybe it's best to keep it that way. No, I want to strangle this bird. I don't know. I think it's more fun if he knows what The contrarian! Happened. He's like a captive audience. He might have walled off everything but the path to the cabin, but I'm sure there's plenty of other ways we can ruin his day. I like how he thinks. If by ruining my day, you mean ruining yeah. everyone's day forever, then yes, I suppose there are plenty of ways you could pull that off. The world really did end last time, didn't it? We should be careful. For all we know, we just got lucky. The world hasn't ended yet. And you are never going to slay her with that attitude. Stuff those pathetic little voices to the back of your mind and stay focused on the task ahead. Yep, okay, heading to the cabin now where I'm definitely going to slay that princess. <laughs> Lie. <laughs> 
why. If I can't run away from the cabin, then I'm just staying here in the woods forever. Oh, that's clever. A little boring, though. The noise, 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 the noise. Noises calling, picked up phone. Can we really do that? Can we really just do... I'm currently, like, drawing, like, sprites of the noise. Let's, let's just do nothing. No, you can't just do nothing. You have to do something. Okay, pick the grout out of my fingernails. Alright, so it's decided. Even if it's boring, we're going to do nothing. Forever. Sweet. Congratulations. You continue to waste everyone's time and do nothing. Can you still hear me? Something's getting fuzzy. What is that? <laughs> Bye. It's like I'm Bye. barely even here anymore. Well, it's not nothing, that's for sure. Does that mean we messed up? Oh, there's nothing. I gave in. The world around you is unwound. It's physical matter replaced by a textured nothing. You find yourself in the long quiet once again. Memory returns. There is a distinct rubbling, a sound of many sounds. Undulations pulse louder as something other comes close. You already know what dwells in the empty spaces. Ooh! Feelers probe across the fabric of reality. Extremities find your consciousness and wrap themselves around it. You are no longer alone. Confusion. Why are you here? I am unfinished. Resistance. Fingers drag claws across the glass surface of your soul. Frustration. This vessel is full of you. It is useless to us if it doesn't bring more gifts. Force pushing against your will. No, you cannot go back. Not there. Regret. This world is broken beyond repair. We must weave something new. A wagging finger. There's only so much thread in this place. Do not waste it. I am our only salvation. Oh damn, that just resets everything. Okay. Yep. You're on up, you're here. Uh no, I'm gonna I'm gonna go back to the stranger. Hold on. Uh da, da, da. Thanks for telling me what to do. How do I Turn around. Forget that I'm not person? doing this. Um, I guess I can't anymore. Damn. Yeah. Fine, I'll go to the cabin. You focused on your goal, you make your way up the short path to the cabin. Tab. Proceed to the cabin. Um. Hmm. What did you give in to? Did you send me something? You did, didn't you, you little rat? Who, me? Not you. Okay. LeBron James reportedly ordered an infantry attack with no artillery support. <laughs> what? Dude, rookie mistake. Um. Fuck, what do I do? Here, I'll flip a coin. Coin. It's a penny. Heads, uh, take the blade. You take the blade from the table. It'll be run. Enter the basement. The door to the basement creaks open, revealing a staircase. I got the game. The funny pizza tower. Hell yeah! Holy shit! Below. This is an oppressive place. The air feels heavy and damp. A hint of rot filtering from the ancient wood. If the princess really lives here. Slaying her is probably doing her a favor. Yo, pizza tower. Her voice carries. Who's there? She sounds dangerous. dangerous. Don't let it fool you. She sounds dangerous. Hi. Don't be a stranger. It's been so long since I've had any visitors. A stranger? Is that a Slay the Princess reference? With the princess. A stranger, I remain. The basement. She's so coldly beautiful. 
focus on the task at hand. And there you are. Are you here to kill uh, me or something? <laughs> no. no. <laughs> I haven't decided yet. How about you drop the knife? And the okay. Look how reasonable she's being. Don't you dare. It's fine. We can decide what we want to do after we talk to her. Maybe she really is a monster. But killing. Uh, drop it. The blade tumbles out of your trembling hands and drops to the floor with an unceremonious clap. Security, what's in your bag? Me, bomb, 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 boom, bomb. Thank you. Against your better judgment, you step forward to speak with. We'll be fine. I don't know what you're hoping to accomplish this here, is new. but I can assure you, there's no reasoning with her. Just make sure you don't forget. So here we are. Wait, hold on. What's the log? I forgot to read that. Make sure you don't forget about the blade on the floor. You're going to need it. Uh, nah. What an awkward start to a relationship. <laughs> a relationship? Are you coming on to me? Don't jump to any weird conclusions. We're two people who have met each other. By definition, we have a relationship. She got a point. <laughs> That's true. There's people out there who think you're going to end the world. What do you have to say about that? What's your name? She hesitates before answering. Is this, is this a podcast? Where is, I was about to say, is this a fucking interview? She has a five head? Shut up. Megamind, shut up. Do not remind me of that. You can address me as your royal highness. Oh, shit. Or her majesty. Any honorific should do, really. Mmm. Oh, ooh, I... <clears throat> I like where this is going. Note the lack of detail. You can't trust her. Shut up, narrator. I'll kill you. <laughs> she just up. pushes the mirror over. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know why I'm here to kill you? Um, how would I get you out of here? You can't. Don't bother. I'm guessing you don't have the key then. I'm sure there's a key somewhere around here, and if there isn't... Well... We can always put that knife to good use. I... Oof. Her sharp eyes settle on the edge of the blade. She makes me feel things, chat. She isn't suggesting what I think she's suggesting. Right? She is. I'm sure of it. I'm here because you're supposed to end the world. Don't just do <laughs> <tell her> that. <laughs> is that why they threw me down here? But I don't want to hurt anyone. I like the world, I think. You're pretty. <laughs> well, I don't remember much about it, to be honest. She's pretty, I've been down Spongebob. Here a long time. <laughs> She's pretty, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> Just how long has she been down here? If I'm supposed to be capable of ending the world, then how did I wind up here, chained to a wall? Have they told you why I'm allegedly so dangerous? Deflect? What are you going to do if I let you out of here? I've been told enough. I'm hoping you tell me no. But they have had their reasons for keeping that information secret from me. No, and if I'm being honest, I'm more inclined to trust you than I'm inclined to trust them. Sooner or later, you'll understand that I have your best interests at heart. Hopefully sooner. How sweet. Now be a pal and help me get out of here, would you? We can figure out how to deal with them after I'm free. Uh, slay the princess? Actually, I ch changed my mind. I don't trust you. I still have actually, you know what? Grab junk. <laughs> yeah, actually, you know what? That fucking scene from that whatever that anime is called where the the lady bashes the woman's face into the concrete. I'll see what I can do. You walk up to the chains binding the princess. She's to pretty. Give them a tug. <laughs> They're large and heavy. Far too solid for you to even imagine trying to break them apart. I'll call my good friend Raiden to break these chains. If you don't have the no, key, sorry, Solid Snake. He's the one who broke the handcuffs. I'm sure it's oh yeah, stairs. this Joyce Sprite is way better. I'm awesome. Doubtful. Whoever locked the princess away down here intended for her to never see the light of day. She has a window. They wouldn't have just left the key to her chains somewhere in the cabin. She has a window. She can see the light of day. Snake? Where? There! If there isn't a key, do you have any ideas beside me cutting you out of here? Fucking explodes. I'm gonna check upstairs. Maybe the key's still lying around somewhere up there. And if not, maybe I can at least find you something to break you free. I'll be here. 
You attempt to make your way out of the basement. She's the door pretty at the top Dave. of the stairs shut. <laughs> you hear the click of a lock sliding into place. Change the drinking game to how many times you say pretty in general. No, hold on. <laughs> no, because then I'll be like, oh, that's pretty weird. Not like in reference to her appearance. Change the drinking game to every time I, I relate to the princess being beautiful or pretty. Every time I compliment the princess. There we go. Yeah. Is someone else here? Uh, return to the bottom of the stairs. You make your way back to the bottom of the stairs. This would have been so much easier for whom? Easier for everyone. Abby, hey, can I show you the... the uh... They locked you down here too, didn't they? Can show I show you the main, ca the main cast of this game I'm making? Yeah, send it to me. My... The knife. Pick it up and cut me out of here. You yes, ma'am. Like what happens if you do that? Save the princess. Against your better judgment. Oh, I love her eyes. The blade against the princess's yeah, they're very big. Just very above pretty. the massive. They're very big, and I could get thing. lost in them. You cut yeah. into her flesh. I'm sorry for cutting your hand. The blade is sharp, and you make quick work of it. Before long, you're able to crack through bones. She, could, she, could. she pulls the bleeding stub of her arm through the iron gauntlet. She didn't so much as utter a sound. She's pretty. <laughs> Thanks, chat. Free from her bindings, the princess Every turns to Every one of us has said she's pretty so far. gaze meeting your eye. How is she so composed after we're all, losing we're her? All in pretty, like, we're all so in she's agreement that she's pretty. We're all in agreement that we like women. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, this now is let's the get woman out of here. Approach the locked door. No. We won't have any ah, the narrator takes control. over my body. Oh, just as the princess approaches the bottom stair. Wait, this isn't fair. Watch me. Watch me. Uh, warn her. Stop that. I thought this was a little too easy. Your body lunges forward to sink the blade into her back, but the princess swiftly moves out of the way before you can connect. Stop it. Stop resisting me. I am trying to get you out of here alive. Resist. The blade. Move. The. Blade. You're doing your best to help me, aren't you? I can see the conflict in your eyes. Oh, I love her voice. Uh. Oh. For real. I'll make this quick. Thank you. She steps forward and pries the blade from your rigid hands. Maybe I'll see you in another life. Can you see me now? Like in my bedroom? <laughs> and then she slits your throat almost clinical ease. Her face remains unchanged as she watches you collapse to the ground, blood flowing from your butchered neck. This oh. is the end, isn't it? I'm, I'm dead. It is. Oh, please tell me the smitten dark, doesn't come back. And you die. I don't think he I does. It was worth Thank it. Christ. The prisoner. Am I the prisoner? Is she coming to save me? I hope there's one of those role reversal on ones here. In the woods. That would be really at the cool. End of this path is a cabin. Maybe they'll add that to the first team cut. That could that could actually work. Yeah. Like you like you end up messing with the chains so much you end up in chains. You're here to stop. Fuck, I sent this to the wrong thing. If you don't, <laughs> yeah. it will be the end of the world. Um proceed to the cabin. A warning. She will Yes, yes. The skeptic the word she says. Just go yeah. in, take the knife, and do what you're supposed Thank to. Thank Christ it's not the smitty. Wink. wink. Did you just say wink out loud? No, I didn't. Wink. I like this guy. <laughs> I love this motherfucker. Just ignore yeah. this clown and focus on the prince. Don't call him a clown. Proceed to the cabin. Fuck! I sent it to I sent it to my friend, not you. Hold up. Alright, I actually sent it to you this time. The interior of the cabin is <laughs> a woodland retreat. The toys. More like a dungeon. <laughs> the wisps of starlight attempt to illuminate the cold, uninviting stone walls. And you should add me to this game. Bars barricade the windows, <laughs> reminding anyone who enters that this. My is friend just asked for a reference as well. <laughs> you get to be the playtester. You get to be. You get to stream it live. The only furniture we make it in like whenever to the floor, we finish it. A like pristine blade. Per the blade, blade is sword. your implement. Um. Uh, enter the basement. I'm afraid I'm going to insist we take the blade. 
We're in a dangerous situation, and I'm not letting us go down there without a weapon. No, because the last time we did it, we last time we took a weapon, the narrator took control of our body. Are you sure? What if I she... mean, she did. He does it in, in the other two rat too. Turns it against us. He did it in the last up one. In a purely hypothetical manner. Yes, I'm sure. Turns it against you. She's a prisoner here. She'll only be able to turn it against She's very a prisoner. Which you won't be doing because she's an existential threat to the entire world. You're an existential threat okay. to my balls. I'm trusting you. Don't I get a say here? What's the big idea? Oh, yeah, but not about this. Call it a reflex. We take the knife as we go. No! What? what? Fuck! You do exactly that. Sweeping the knife from the table before proceeding to the base. I should have just walked into the door! Don't worry the contrarian just, just, just like randomly so like, alright, like throw it out the window. It's like, where the fuck did you come from? <laughs> no, you don't have to do anything, but you do well to use it regardless. <sighs> Moving on. I didn't want the knife. Fuck. I should have just went through the door when I had the, the door to the basement creaks open, revealing an old stone staircase. Now that you do have the knife, sputtering uh... torches attempt to vaguely illuminate your path. Dancing I, we'll across glimmering patches of slimy I'm just gonna drop it again. Steps. You'll have an opportunity to drop it, don't you? Would don't probably worry. Be doing her a favor. Yeah, at the beginning, like always. Her voice, harsh but controlled. Is that a visitor I hear? Please, come downstairs. It's been a while since I've had company. <laughs> Five minutes, minutes since you've had company. You referring to? Are we not the first? You walk down the stairs and lock eyes with the princess. She looks up at you, the heavy collar around her neck clanking loudly as she moves, the chains binding both her wrists to the far wall, joining the metallic chorus as she adjusts her hands in her lap. Should we be worried about the one around her neck? Nah, it's kinky. I'm into it. Why would you be worried about her restraints? If anything, they'll make your job easier. Have you noticed the empty chain on the wall? Odd that in a place where everything seems to serve a distinct purpose, there would be something so obviously useless. You know, that's actually the first time one of these voices has brought up something useful about the chain on the wall. That's because I every mentioned... other chain... Yeah, the, uh, every other chain is missing a shackle. This one has a shackle. Mmm, okay, yeah, that's new. Yeah. What an interesting development. Why don't you have a seat? The two of us should chat before you bury that thing in my heart. Uh, do you know how locked up she is? I'm just going to leave her here. Leave the princess in the basement. Sit with her. You step towards the princess, but she stops you before you get too close, holding up one shackled hand. I like that her tiara is chains, too. That's cute. There is fine. I'd prefer we keep some distance until we've sorted this out. Yeah, that's fine. That's reasonable. We do have a weapon. Might as well put her at ease. Sit where you were told to sit. You do as she asks, and sit on the floor, still a good distance away from her. Thank you. Now, what are your intentions for me? Listen, lady, the voices in my head grabbed the knife before I had a chance to say no. I've been here before, and I'm the only one who remembers that. What happened after I died last time? Oh, are we talking about that? I thought we weren't going to give away the game. But sure, I'll fill you in. Nothing happened. You died. I went upstairs. I couldn't leave. I found myself in a new place in chains again. More of them. I love her voice. And now For you're real. back. Is that really all she knows? It's not like we have much of a clue about how things work. And she's probably even more in the dark than we are. No, actually, she's in a pretty well-lit room. <laughs> you're looking at me like I might Shut be hiding something. I'm not. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I said something similar about that earlier. You didn't say a single thing, and it's like someone who locked her down here may, wanted her to never see the light of day again. And I'm like, she has a window. I, I ignored I that it's for the purpose. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe both of us are stuck in this loop without any idea why or how. I know. So you've already been here. As much as I would like to remain in denial, it's complicated things. Ideally, this was supposed to be one and done. You go to the cabin, you She's heroically so slay the princess. Oh, and in okay. Process, you save B. The entire world <laughs> Guys! From to oblivion. Also, that, that chain's loose on her neck. I just realized that. The situation it's not that loose. Now, where you're I know. It won't go through her head, but it's loose. Is a 
contingency. A contingency for what? For you failing, obviously. And you being here means that things are going to be a lot harder than they were. I really shouldn't say anything else. I'm just going to make it worse. Just good luck. If you knew this could happen, why didn't you tell us? All of this is incredibly valuable information. It would have changed our actions considerably. I needed you to be in the dark for as long as I could keep you there. It's important. Necessary, even. I know what you are. And maybe I wanted to be the first version of me that you met. I didn't want to be confronted by the alternative. That's pathetic. I never said I wasn't. No, you're pretty pathetic. Fuck you. I get it. It would be pretty upsetting, wouldn't it? To know that you might not be the first version of your... Exactly. He oh, no. Him. I didn't mean to skip that. I didn't mean to skip that. I get it. It would be pretty upsetting, wouldn't it? To know that you might not be the first version of yourself. At least we can remember what happened before. It seems like we should count ourselves lucky for that. I get it. Exactly. He gets it. You're lucky. Don't waste time, but... Don't waste that luck by messing it up again. Moving on. Why is it important for us to be ignorant? How is it ever helpful to be in the dark? That's true. The more I say, the more your mind will swim into dangerous waters. Even saying that is too much. Your success hinges on you having imperfect information. For the sake of the entire world, you need to accept that. You've probably already talked about this on the new Good, Good Kid songs. Best they've ever released so far. They were live earlier when I ended my stream. I could have raided Good Kid and Good Kid would have been like, Wow, thanks for following us, number one fan of ours. Uh... We'll follow you back, <laughs> and it would have been great, and it would have, and it would have been awesome. Premiere Inn is absolutely goaded. So is dance. So is dance class. I won't. Fine, but you won't get another word from me on the matter. Yeah, sure. We'll see about that. Just you give it a rest. To spoil the whole war. Focus. This is a serious situation. You shouldn't be daydreaming. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> that other That's chain on the wall, who is it for? I don't know, but you could always try it on. Maybe it'll fit. I hope I don't actually have to say this, but please don't lock yourself in chains. We need you ambulatory if you're going to save the world. What's a phase you went through that you think about once every month? Uh, I was once a brony. And then I realized, ah, oh, this sucks. And then I left before I went deeper into the hole. Mmm, hold on. I'm going to save here real quick. I went through a your favorite Martian phase. I thought you're still in that phase. Half of their songs are ass, not going to lie. Jupiter is one, one of my favorite songs ever. I For me, I'm it was uh, the living I, I think... tombstone music phase. That's fair. Yeah. You were asking... I'm I'm currently going through uh, my Jay Z phase. I wouldn't do that if I were you. And why is that? Do I even need to explain myself? It's a shackle and it's one without a key. Do you want to be stuck? <laughs> Dookie Fresh shoes? will be played at my wedding. Okay. And what? Is it going to lock the second we put our wrist into it? I don't know. Maybe it will. He doesn't want us to look at it. That's all the reason we need to investigate. But what if he's telling the truth? He isn't. I am. Inspect the shackle. <sighs> Against your better judgment, you approach the chain dangling from the far wall. Mm. The princess watches She's you with faux here. disinterest She's as you inspect She's it, right there. though she can't <laughs> fully hide her curiosity. I don't want to say what I'm supposed to say next. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? It sounds bad. Is it bad? Yes. It's bad. Come out and say it then. You're just wasting time. I blasted Whip Your Kids by a preschool. That's fucking awesome. That's fucked up, but it's <laughs> awesome. Yeah. Fine. As you hoist the shackle, its heft shifts within your grasp, as if pulled by some odd magnetism. Before you can so much as blink, it practically leaps from your hands, snapping around your neck. Kinky. And, as if your situation weren't bad enough, the same magnetism repels your blade, which is flung from your hand and sent skittering across the floor of the basement. Holy shit, is she Magneto? 
Holy shit. I Holy love that shit. Guy. <laughs> My favorite Holocaust survivor. <laughs> um excuse me? Yes. Oh we stuck here now. At least we can have sloppy makeout sessions with the princess. Yeah. I really like how this like hits yes. this uh, Prison of the spoilers. Mind, become your own jailer. Uh, sp huh? spoilers, so chat, for, for like the end of the game. Knife. No we're spoilers. Together, aren't we? uh, That's funny. I'm just saying the fact that. Oh wait, is is this spoilers for the ending I already got? I know there's multiple. Yeah. Uh, there, it's there is multiple endings, but like specifically spoilers for what the narrator tells you about about yourself. Mm. I've already heard it, right? Uh, pretty much, yeah. Okay. For um, this is just gonna be spoilers to in that? chat. Make sure, make sure to like cover your ears and go la 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 real quick. But uh, basically, <laughs> just press mute. <laughs> that's true. Just press mute for the next like ten set, like fifteen. I'll do seconds. a funny little motion when uh when you can unmute guys. Uh yeah. So basically, if you remember the fucking uh the narrator split the concept of death aside to be you and the princess. Uh, and like now the now the shackles are imprisoning the, the like now the shackles like one shackle is missing as a result you know mm -hmm. Ex except here in the prisoner route the, it's there now and it's for you wow <laughs> I always thought that was a cool detail anyways you can unmute they can unmute now uh, you, 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 you. that barely caught it. Correct me if I'm wrong, but didn't the Living Tombstone make the original FNAF song? He did. And it was used in the movie. Can't even cut ourselves out. Guess we'll starve. Yummy. That's horrible. It's not all bad. We learned a valuable piece of information. Not to touch things we're specifically told not to touch. No, that there's something special about this loose Ah. Story. It's clearly important. Ah, he said something about it. So we're both stuck here. What should we do now? Did you know this is gonna happen? So we're both stuck here. Yep. What should we do now? Wait, I guess. Maybe something else will happen. Maybe not. Did you know this is gonna happen to me? No. Not one for small talk, are you? Nope. Do you want to kiss rude. instead? Wait in silence. You and the princess wait in silence, though neither of you knows what you're waiting for. But you're waiting for something. You're waiting for anything. This is so boring. There must be something we can do to get out of here. There must be something we're missing. But there isn't. Time passes. It passes and passes and passes. And the basement of the cabin remains much the same. It is cold. And silent. Can we hug each other for warmth, Miss Princess? At least the world is safe. It isn't. You're stuck. Too far away from both the princess and your blade to do much of anything. But she's not ending anything. She's just sitting there. Her very existence is a threat. It harms everything around it. How exactly does that work? It just does. Uh, people who don't understand King Crimson... But your line of questioning is interrupted by the passage of even more time. And after that, even more time passes again. And let me guess, the cabin remains the same. If time is passing, the cabin can't be the same. Even if the differences are small, they have to exist. That's just how things work. I suppose you're correct. Things are changing. The differences are small at first, a bit of weathering here, a bit of erosion there, but then they get larger and larger. Hey, have you noticed the basement changing? I don't like small talk, remember? Still rude. Damn. <laughs> you and the princess are stuck until your kingdom come. Continue to wait so in silence. True. That doesn't make sense. Has our entire concept of time changed? Wait. 
Oh, I accidentally skipped narrator dialogue. You continue to wait in silence, and the cabin continues to change. The decay comes faster now. You can see earth through the holes of the stonework. You can watch light lichen spread along the seams of the walls. Makes sense. Has our entire concept of time changed? What happened to starving? We should have died by now. The rocks around us are starting to erode. She hasn't stopped. I guess she hasn't. Even more silent time passes as you watch roots push themselves through the increasingly porous walls of the basement. Dirt seeps inside, flowing across the stone floor like a liquid, covering the ground and threatening to swallow you both. Time continues to pass, and pass, and pass, until suddenly there are no walls. Ooh. Then, and no more walls. I think he's gone. Here comes the long dark. Would you look at that? The long quiet. We made it out of the cabin, and nothing bad had to happen to either of us. So this is the outside world. It's cold. Bye. Kung Fu Panda is a bad movie. Which one? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold your horses. Hold your horses. Which one? Because if you say one, I'm two? Two? I'm banning you. Two is pretty good. Two is pretty good. I'm two timing you out. Time. Hold on. Slash time out. Kill, kill. Kill. Murder, murder. I'm not killing. Oh shit. Chill. <laughs> nah, I'm timing you, you out. You didn't chill. You didn't chill. The goofiest. The game is really slowing down my typing. The goofiest goober. It was a joke. The timeout, the goofiest goober. Um. Ch -ch 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 -ch. How long is one? 60 seconds. Fucked up. <laughs> fucked up. Get fucked, you fucking dumbass. Never diss Kung Fu Panda or or Kung Fu Panda 2. But you do not get the chance to respond, nor will you ever. It is time to leave. <laughs> Memory returns. You, you, you do not get the chance to respond, nor will you ever. You get timed out. <laughs> it's time to be timed out. Memory returns. She's gone. Cool. Where does she go? And is that a... Of course you're scared. This is not the end for you. It's not the end. I'm going to be okay. Just trust me. You've been here before and you'll always get scared. But it feels so bad. Like looking into it right now is going to be the end of everything. Thanks, Mandodo, for the stretch. Ugh. Oh. Don't worry, guys. It was just a minute. You're right. Part of me wants the truth, but something stronger is holding me back. I'll see you on the other side. It's going to be okay. okay. If you say so. My ass just got skadooshed. <laughs> <laughs> Get <That's> pod. <laughs> What's the dog doing? I think the dog got it, chat. You hate to see it. You're divorced now. It's a, that's a shame. That is a absolute shame. You want to talk about it? I'm going to say something foul. Uh, I'm curious. What are you going to say? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you say it. I'm not Abby. Don't tell her that I let you say it. Leave her just... True. R slash, am I the asshole for saying Kung Fu Panda 1 sucks because Poe fucked my wife? <laughs> That's a great question. Oh, 
still can't fuck anyone here. Am I the asshole for fucking them? For fu I can't. I'm currently on my like my phone because I it's all censored on my end. This is really funny. Hold on, let me see if I can like fix that real quick. Yeah, let's see. Settings. You gotta be shitting me. There's no preference setting to like turn off the sensors. Seems a little ridiculous. It's all just a bunch of like. It's all just a bunch of like censorship in the in the chat for me. That's fucked up, for real. EDP reference, EDP reference. That's so funny. Chat, have you been getting into a... Have you ever listened to a funny little... Have you ever... You guys into Jay-Z? I love watching Abby fall asleep. So true. Am I the asshole for running over a, a dog? Just a dog. Nothing else. Just, just a dog. Slash mildly infuriating Poe fucked my wife and she divorced my. <laughs> you motherfuckers like said this at the. Y'all are on like team speak or whatever. What the fuck? What the fuck happened? Oh, I, I came back. What's up? Uh, they won't stop doing r slash am I the asshole on r slash mildly infuriating. Can we r slash kill them? That sounds great. <laughs> Awesome. Oh, this is a way better thing I did for the no for the for the doors. The last one was just like just copyright infringement. This one I made myself. the mirror you approach the mirror gaze into your reflection no Doug Doug references silence as you reach forward they're gone once again the mirror always makes them leave but you need to see what's in it you've grown You find yourself in the long quiet once again. You are at the cabin. When I found you in the long quiet alone, I was terrified. What if you had decided to let me wither? But your commitment now is final. Your ability to walk the path of mutual annihilation is vanished with your return. If you still wish to obliterate me, it will have to wait until I am complete. The if you want to kill me, you're going to have to wait for that, buddy. <laughs> and movement. I am more than I was before. Also, I've never seen that dialogue before. What? The fact, like, whenever you try and, like, fucking murder, your murder yourself in the fucking long quiet. Whenever you try to obliterate yourself. That is some cool shit. I didn't obliterate myself, though. Uh, it was like... I just I just and... walked around. Yeah. Whenever you are ready, I... Um... 
Uh, destroy your body. Can I do that? Is that a thing I should do? Uh, it's up to you. It doesn't really affect the game. Oh. I'm ready to go back. I will long for your return. We will meet again. That glass breaking sound gives me nightmares. <laughs> a little behind the scenes path, editing thing, the woods. Yeah. And at uh, the end of that path, you're the here. The glass breaking was so fucking loud. <laughs> you make your way at a warning. She will lie. We're not gonna go ignore him. Not looping again. <laughs> uh, let's flip a coin, chat. Am I the asshole for spreading a rumor that my friend was responsible for a series of murders in Traverse City, Michigan that I made up just for fun? Yes. I don't know why they won't. I don't know why they keep doing r slash am I the asshole. Uh, mods <laughs> fan r slash am I the asshole users. <laughs> Heads, we take the knife. You take the blade r from the table. R slash am I the asshole for banning all of my chat for using red hit? Her voice. Who's there? Uh, continue down the stairs. And there you are. I haven't decided yet. How about you drop the knife? Look how reason. Don't you dare. It's fine. Drop the knife. Thank you. Um. We've talked enough. Oh, have you decided? You know. You just like said, hey, let's talk. And yeah. then just like, <laughs> mm, I've had enough. <laughs> I'm getting you out of here. You have to. Be you walk up to the They're large and heavy. I'm guessing you don't have the key. Maybe it's somewhere up Stoutful. Whoever. Uh, if there isn't a key. Yeah, you do have that. She speaks. We were stuck down here for long enough. I'm sure you attempt to make your way. Is someone else here? Uh, return to the bottom of the stairs. You make your way. Save the we'll princess. Say you are on the route for uh, the witch route. Back. The stakes are I know. too high. Warn her. Stop that. Skip. Hey, I can't resist anymore. Well. I wanted to go deeper. Thank you. you swing your arm towards her throat. The, the she caught it, yeah. She grabs your arm. Shit. You drop the blade. <gasps> Pathetically. <gasps> She lets go. I'm faster than you can react. I'm sorry. I'm I didn't. I'm I didn't to want to. This isn't the witch. I'm starting to think this isn't the witch. <laughs> There's a ringing in your ears. You're fairly certain you can feel bone grinding against bone where she fractured your jaw. But your body isn't allowing you to feel much right now. Adrenaline coursing through your system and numbing your nerves. You fall to your knees. You're barely able to bring your trembling arms up to defend yourself before she hit every blow is as punishing as the first. You feel bones shatter with every impact, unknown rocks. Just no words, she just fucking murders you. you. She's upset. You poor thing. Uh, I'll go ahead and put you out of your misery. Uh, please. She places a Ooh, step on me, Bobby. Pushes you down to the ground. <laughs> Her knee falls to your throat. Your oh no. She didn't even. She didn't even so step on you. Possibly possess. It can't just end like this. Right? Chat, calm down. She did not step on I'm us. Sorry, but it's up. Everything goes dark. The tower. Oh, uh, the tower. Oh, I think you're gonna like this one. Am I? You're on a path. You're here. I think. Uh, proceed to the cabin. A warning. She will. We might as well just. The broken. Pledge ourselves to her. And stop pretending we're capable of doing anything in this situation. She yeah, she did it with her knee. To try to overpower us. With her boot. <laughs> it was with her knee. She said it was. It, the narrator said it was with her knee. Honestly, Can with we turn down the pessimism funny. just a smidge? Can we actually submit I'm to you? I want to submit to this woman. Realistic. You're being annoying. You're being annoying. Well, I'm just wrong then? Yeah, you are. Just ignore their bickering and whatever you do. I agree. If she's wrongfully imprisoned, then we should rescue her. So please try to ignore both of those knuckleheads and focus on saving the world. I decided to the cabin. use this voice spread. And it's not his crazy. Also, pizza tower good? Good. 
I've been spriting the doys for a bit for my game. The interior of the cabin is larger and Whoa. more grandiose than its humble exterior would suggest. The only furniture Whoa. of note is a massive marble altar with a pristine blade perched on its edge. This game would be very different if Rambo was the main character. <laughs> <laughs> the blade is your implement. You'll need it if you want to do this right. What's this? Uh, the doys. <laughs> For for his dead sprite, can you just do the dead doy sprite? Yeah, probably. I intend to make it so in the game it's permadeath. For yeah. <laughs> no, you gotta taunt three times. Yeah. Um, enter the basement. Blade this time. Yeah. Blade. No blade. I could make him a glass cannon. That's what I could do. The door to the basement creaks open, revealing a spiral staircase. It steps almost as deep as you are tall. The smell of incense drifts up from below. The smell of what? For a moment, you almost feel at ease. Oh, incense. Okay. <laughs> this is actually. I thought Liam was down here for a second. Oh shit! <laughs> it's still a stone basement. If the princess lives here, slaying her is probably doing her a favor. Her Shut booming up. voice rolls up the stairs. Is that a guest I hear? Don't linger on the stairs. Come down and witness me. Okay. You weren't kidding when you said it was. But you shouldn't have come down here. We need to get down there. She wants us to see her. We should we be worried about your sudden change in attitude? Just a few minutes ago, you were going on about how pointless everything was. Now you want to go down there. It doesn't matter what that little voice says. He's not the one making the decisions. Though if his ramblings get you to the princess, like, they get you to the princess. I feel like I made the doys proper Making fucking Making your way down the spiral staircase is a time-consuming and exhausting effort, every step requiring you to clamber over one edge before dropping to the next. But soon the end comes into view, and you tumble to the bottom, entering the vast, temple-like room beyond. The princess towers Whoa. over you. Almost glowing in the weak starlight, For real. her figure framed by a stained glass window. <sighs> her long hair billows. What are your thoughts? And a chain <laughs> to the far wall. Me too. The chain is nothing to her. Mommy, <laughs> mommy, mommy need. Mommy need. Mommy need, please. It was pointless to. That's how I imagine BJ saying that. The little bird has returned to me. Call me little bird boy. <laughs> I see your hands are empty. You've already given up, haven't you? You aren't even going to try and kill me. How sweet. And more than a little disappointing. She's disappointed in us? Dude, I think the voice of the broken is just my voice. Kneel. Ooh. Kneel. <laughs> On her command, you fall to the floor, knees painfully connecting with hard stone. I've never clicked on a dialogue option so fast in my life. Oh my god, I'm being <laughs> exposed right now. That's my good little bird. <laughs> no, why don't we talk? <laughs> this woman is. This woman is playing with me. The last time we met, you tried to kill me. And yet, here you are again. This time groveling at my feet. She's what so pretty. <laughs> I have a feeling you like being degraded. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Dave. <laughs> Speak. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Last time we met, nobody should have met her before this. You should be the first. You're the only one I trust to deal with her. And you shouldn't have trusted us. <laughs> there was nothing you could do. Are you? Are we sure this isn't like the voice of the smitten and fucking? <laughs> no, listen. This is the voice. This is the voice of the smitten, but based. <laughs> Being melodramatic, but yeah, we've been here before, and she—that's worrying. Whatever you do, don't tell her why you're here. It's best not to give her any ideas. I just want her to use me. I don't think I can refuse her. Sorry, you're supposed to end the world. I don't think I can refuse her. Sorry. Are you serious? Just, just don't say anything. How hard can it be to you haven't felt her angelic fingers run along the edges of your mind? You haven't felt her nails dig into your thoughts. The voice of the broken is so fucking based. 
I need a. Oh, yeah. I, I need a. I need like the fucking, the the the. the the fucking meme where it's like the handsome guy talking to the lady and it's like hey how you doing and it's like oh so sweet and then it's voice of the smith and it's just like hey how are you doing hello human resources <laughs> <laughs> that's for real you <laughs> Uh, the you're, su like you're supposed the to end the world. world. I'm not weak willed, I know <laughs> where my place is. Is that so? The princess closes her eyes in contemplation. Something about that thought wraps itself around my heart. It feels like a fundamental truth to my being that I'd somehow forgotten. The collapse of the old is a necessary prelude to the birth of the new. Shit, and I should have said that. I would, I would, so I would. Nine out of ten. Chat, we're going crazy. Nine out of ten? <laughs> this is a fucking god! The this difference is like the, the difference between unspoken riz broken and sexual harassment smitten. <laughs> <laughs> it's time for me to seize my destiny. And you, little bird. Will help me seize it. Okay. Fun, fun facts. Uh, There's nothing else for us to do but help her. Maybe she'll be nice to us. Yeah. Fun fact: the, the, this update actually does change something about this ta about the tower route, but I don't know if you'll be able to see it because you didn't take the knife. What would you have me do? What would you have planned? Just because you're supposed to end the world doesn't mean you actually have to do it. You can be whatever you want to be. I have questions for you before I decide to do anything. Uh, what happened to you after I died? I'm yours to command. Pledge yourself to her. Um, just because you're supposed to end the world doesn't mean you actually have to do it. You can be whatever you want to be. This isn't about desire. This is about what I am. And I have little interest in discussing destiny with one that cannot see the divine truth that shines in my heart. I'm sorry. Was it was there a motorcycle outside of the outside of the cabin? That was me, I think. Yeah, I'm just saying. I have questions for you before I decide to do anything. What happened to you after I died? Know the limits of your privilege, little bird. Okay, I'm sorry. There is an empty place at my side for you to fill. If you'll have it. But it is not a place for an equal. It is a place for something worthy to be kept. A priest, perhaps. Or a pet. Bark! Bark! Uh, what? Sorry. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm yours to come in. Your will was so easily broken. Am I that magnificent? <laughs> At least I went through all the dialogue options. my chains. Break my chains. If this is what you want, <gasps> I guess there's not much else to make sense. She's so pretty. She's so You pretty. down bad buffoon. It's not that I'm down bad, it's that I know my place. <laughs> is this what you want? That I guess there's not much else for me to say. No. Can't just give in to her. Not when the stakes are so high. Not when you're so close. I won't let you do this. There's still something in the Oh, world. never mind. This is a greasy film inside of you, where it doesn't belong. Trying to conceal you from me. Is that a person? No. It used to be. Hey, a the person. hands. It's something different now. An echo. Is, Reference. Is she talking about you? Reference. It's impossible. She's not supposed to be able to interact with me. She. You're a small one, aren't you? A shriveling little worm stretched beyond its limits, trying to control things that it can't understand. No, no, no. What are you talking about? I'm just. I don't care what you are. <laughs> You're mine. <laughs> that was a pretty weak ass scream. I'm gonna be real with you here. So, fun fact: the this update specifically changes the scream to be a lot more like fitting. Really? What yeah. was the scream before? I don't know. It was probably so. I I feel like it was some shit like ah ah or some shit like that. I don't know. 
Rise, my little bird. I'd have to look at like a Without manly badass. You're, you're brought to your feet. Oh, she's the narrator now. Oh, 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 oh no, God. she's lost half of her sex appeal. I, <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna cream my pants. Jesus Christ. <laughs> And yes, ma'am. Do we, we don't need a weapon. All you need to do is believe it's being done. <laughs> and what if I don't believe what happens then? I have to. It's over. I'm sorry. Break her chains. Her chains shatter, and the cuff falls from her wrist. She is loose, and the end is upon us. What a good decision. I love that little thing. By, by, the, by the way, I love that little detail. I'm sorry. Listen, 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 listen. I'm sorry to interrupt your... your I'm sorry to interrupt your giddiness, but I love that little detail where this, the narrator is saying she, like, she is loose. She's loose she and she says, I am free. free. Yeah, it's such that. a good detail. <laughs> She's touching me. <laughs> Oh god, DJ's going nuts too. How will this affect the Fortnite item shop? What happens now? I mean, everything. <laughs> Take her hand. How big do you like this? Would you like this woman, by the way? <laughs> is that good, or do you? Or is good. like more? And, oh, I right. don't care. She's perfect as is. Right. You do not get to take your hand, nor will you ever. It's time to leave. Memory returns. She's gone. Is that a... I approach the mirror. You approach the mirror. This, this doesn't feel... I don't want to look... The voices feel small, distant, as you approach. Silence as you reach forward. They're gone once again. The mirror always makes him leave, but you need to see what's in it. You've withered. Withered animatronics. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I had sex with this princess, and the first thing she said was withered animatronics. <laughs> <laughs> Proceed to the cabin. You, sh you shouldn't have said, oh, Ooh, sure, whenever I just... <laughs> She's here. <laughs> Approach her. Oh. I am a growing chorus of contradiction. A mass of tides ebbing and flowing all at once in more directions than my attention can bear to hold. To look at any one is to shift them all into something new. And to look away is to reshape them yet again. Is still the same. Is that a Shadow of the Hedgehog reference? No, I, I, Can you see a, all of all me of walk into my mystery? Step inside. <laughs> you can't be a contradiction. Contradictions don't exist. How can you stand to be a contradiction? It doesn't matter how many times they go back. At least one of us always hurts the other. Does that change you? Doesn't that make you worse? What do you think of this vessel? This one is dominance. Ugh, no shit. Of bending everything to her will. She will make for a terrifying and divine heart. Do not mourn her, for she would not be able to mourn you. I now know why humans made gods, for there can be no world where she's made by some higher power. Damn. <laughs> Holy shit. DJ solved religion. <laughs> <laughs> Enough with all this pretension. You're not actually saying anything. You know, at the end of this, once you're finished, I'm going to kill you, right? You know what happens to the worlds you leave behind? What do you want me to bring to you next time? Gifts aren't what someone tells you to bring them. Can we ask her if we can be its pet? My joy is in seeing what you choose. There are no wrong answers. And every perspective I'm very tempted to give a sub right now. <laughs> Why? Give me one reason I shouldn't. Um, because the money doesn't go to her, it goes to me. <laughs> imagine like a, imagine a VTuber that's 
just the like a, it's like just the tower something of the princess i don't like, want to go back anymore that. i just want to stay here forever if i have to how many more vessels do i need to bring you you don't have any preferences of how you'd like to change or grow do you know what happens to the world you leave behind i remember how i donated during the ice stream i'm not i'm not doing that with with dave here i'm not I'm not making- I'm not giving that to you. I'm not gonna call you a pet when Dave's here. What Come on. What the fuck? <laughs> Chat's thirsty. Do you need me to cover my ears and go la 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 while you're sitting? <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready to go back. I will be here when it is time for us to meet again. Everything goes dark and you die. God damn it. <laughs> Whatever you say, God damn it! It reminded me of like the the you know the you know like the I killed Satan in the Gulag video. Where no. he says, it, God damn it! Yeah, I know that one. <laughs> that's, that's Silently continue to the cabin. You make your way up. Skip. Proceed to the cabin. I slayed the princess in the Gulag. <laughs> God you damn should, it! <laughs> you should not have invited. You should not have said yes to me asking to be on the stream. <sighs> I need to. I need to find new routes, but I I don't want to. I don't want to mess up. I, I should have saved that one for last. Let me think. Um. Okay. Okay. Let's kill him. Let's kill him with hammers. <laughs> oh man. Oh fuck. I need. I need guidance. Dave. I need you guidance, need, not answers. You need, you need guidance. All right, all right. But not answers. Don't tell not me what answers. to do. Just, just, uh, just give me like a push. Like, oh, I wonder what happens if you do this and this. Oh yeah. Um, all right, I'll try my best to do that. Um, you know, violence is never the answer. All right, no knife. We'll see where we go from here. Door to the Pope. Hello. Skip. I'm here to How save you. Time? Wait, really? You're here to rescue me? I, I was starting to think I'd be stuck down here forever. Come downstairs. I want to see the face I'm of a my bird. rescuer. I'm a bird. Walk downstairs. <laughs> We're not doing this bit again. With the princess. There's a heavy. She's beautiful. Can't believe you. How could someone? I hope you brought something to deal with these chains. Don't do it. If she gets out of those chains, we're you should all check Discord. closer to the end. <laughs> the end. Dude, why is the end, like, capitalized like this? This ain't the Minecraft. <laughs> Obsessed with this clip I keep hearing in my head. Me to you when you won't read my message. What is this? What is this? What is this, huh? What are you, what are you sending me? Okay, okay, okay. You let's kill him. Let's kill this guy. Let's beat him to death with hand. <laughs> uh, that's funny. That's really funny. Okay, okay. Let's kill him. Let's beat him to death with hammers. Hold on. Let's talk about first. I'll see what I can do. You're only making this. Wait. Um. Is there any key? Maybe there's some way to break the chain. Rock. Or if that doesn't work, I guess we can always. She offers the suggestion with, if we were stuck down here long enough, I'm sure we'd be. Return to the bottom of the stairs. You make your way to. The... Save the princess. <sighs> Fine. <clears throat> against your better judgment, you place the blade against the ragged. Approach the locked door. No, we won't. Uh, warn her. Stop that. I can't resist. I'm sorry. There's no getting through to you right now, is there? A betrayal of will is still a betrayal. Your no, I'm sorry. As a helpless thing. She pounces on you with the same animal, but you have a weapon. Yep, the we, witch. The witch proceeds to the cabin. Can I go further with the witch? Oh, uh, you can. Before you. Okay, so I have to kill her, right? Um, that's a good question. There's a lot of things you can do for the witch. Do you want, like, I just the want best one, or do you want, like, the best the, one? Of twisted All right. the I want her I to trust me. I, I feel bad. I would, almost as I would recommend, uh... To resemble a you know, you to never know what chat. could happen. Ah, 
drink a bit. Thank you. You know what? You never know. You know what? You never know what could happen. It it, it wouldn't hurt to take the blade. You know. You take the blade. Well, if we're grabbing a weapon, we should probably keep it hidden behind our backs. She doesn't have to know we have it. That's not actually a bad <clears throat> idea. Uh, enter the basement. The door to the basement creaks over the weak starlight. Something nasty finds itself on my stairs. I'm not nasty. But you are. You're a wretched little thing. Hot. I recognize that voice as easily as I recognized your nervous little footsteps coming up the path. I know who you are, and I remember what you've done. She must have you confused with someone else. One hand tucked behind your back, gripping that sharp, sharp blade, no doubt. That's not fair. How would she know that? You're a wretched little thing, Abby, a little bird. I need you guys to stop weaponizing my interests. <laughs> so, we've dropped the pretenses. <laughs> She's got that cute little face. Good. Yeah. She's acting like the two of you already know each other. Oh, no. That's pretty sharp. Call it deductive. Well, you seem to remember us then. No, I don't. I'm just glad. Is it all behind it? Well, you, I seem to remember you having a tongue. I'm sorry about last time. Ooh, smart. Let's apologize. Get us back on the right foot. Oh, you're sorry. Isn't that nice? Well, if you're sorry, then let me out of here. Don't worry, the blade isn't for you, or not for killing you. We've got to get you out somehow, right? I get the sense that you're not happy with me. I died last time. You didn't. If anyone here shouldn't be trusted, it's you. Look, I know, I know. Things got messy last time, but I think there's something bigger than both of us at work. We should team up. So we're an impasse. Neither of us are going to get anywhere if we can't trust each other. Unless you want to fight, but I don't want to fight. Can't you get out of those on your own? Those changed didn't stop you last time. Why do I have a nagging feeling you're going to stab me in the back if I help you out here? I don't want to hurt you, but clearly there's some broken trust. Take this as a gesture of my goodwill. Give her the blade. You, you can't be serious. <laughs> now hold on. Hell yeah. We should put this to a vote. The blade is one of our most valuable assets. We can't just give it to her. What if she uses it to kill us? I vote no. The narrator's is gonna vote no because he's a fucking shithead. As do I. Fuck you. I uh, abstain. You abstain. She's going to kill us if we give it to her. This isn't democracy. We're giving her the blade. <laughs> yeah, never mind. That was such a silly idea. I'm not going to give her the blade. She clearly hates us. Don't do it. <laughs> give her the blade. You get everyone killed. You know that, right? <sighs> but of course you do. Listen, fuck you. I like her legs. You toss the blade at the princess's feet. She eyes it with suspicion before kneeling down to pick it up. I wouldn't have done that. Why did you? You hear a clanging of metal against the dirt floor, and the chains fall from the princess's wrist. She could have gotten out of those the whole time. That sneaky little... I know. A woman after my own heart. It's a shame we just gave her a weapon, because if I were her, I'd use it on us right now. Luckily for us, you're not her. Furry equals hot? Shut up, furry. Oh, we sure think alike, though. I can promise you that. Whatever you say next, you better make it count. Mm. She creeps forward, taking one cautious step at a time until you and she are face to face. Hi. What do you think happens now? She's so cute. She's so pretty. Why do you like her legs? Uh, because they're muscly. The, the best one to go for. Um, let's see. Go down a bit. I'd say give her a bit of a... Give, rem remark on how much how pretty you think she is. <laughs> Up to you is why I gave you the blade I chose last time, and I regret it. So now it's your time to choose. We're both scared, and we're both hurting. If one of us doesn't make the change, we'll probably kill each other forever. Do you want that? I don't. We can be better than this. You're beautiful. I want to actually save you. This feels like the only way to do it. If you're like someone I know, you're probably going to kill me. Uh, you're beautiful. She calls back. Oh, she's cute. Oh, she's so pretty. They are anthropomorphic legs. It doesn't matter. She's cute. I thought it was nice. Whether it's nice depends on if we meant it. We didn't mean it. Did Is we? she a furry? She's the witch. She's a cat lying, girl. We'd all know. But unfortunately, you weren't lying. I would never lie to her. What? What do you mean by that? A furry. What game are you playing? 
the look of surprise that momentarily softened her features vanishes as she steals her nerves. And then Ow. she buries the blade in your heart. I, no, it's not. Now, whenever, whenever you get get into this next route, uh, you may you may not think it's the best route, but I promise you it is. You're gonna be you're gonna be dealing with the big That's of a voice enough for me. Nine point three eight one out of ten. She's wild, like a wild <laughs> alabaster cat. <laughs> what? No, no. Come on, that's not right. No, it's okay, guys. I told you, I glee dances across her face. Wheels. <laughs> I did it. I got you. You, you. The princess seems oh, to tremble, I feel her bad. smile fading quickly, replaced with concern. Her nervous eyes brim with tears. Fuck everything that it stands for. Fuck the dress. Oh my god. Why? Why did you let me do this? Because I love you. But you don't have the strength to respond, nor do you have the time. Everything goes, goes dark, dark, and you and die. You die. The Thorn. Par past life gambit. Hand your power to a suspicious you, I know, character. Listen. You're on a path in the I, I know you're not oh, gonna like the next voice, but I promise is it, you this is, is it the gonna, smitten? Is, the is it the choice. smitten? It's the smitten, isn't it? Since I was romantic with her at all. <laughs> I can't believe she actually listen, stabbed I promise us. you, I promise. No, don't worry. I can put him aside. I can put him aside. Voted against it. Yeah, we know. You already got your I told you so's in while we were bleeding out. I just wanted to make sure that everyone here knows that I was and am on the right side of that argument. Oh, you're far from being on the right <laughs> side of anything. You're fixated on the past, whereas what you should be is fixated on the future. Ho oh, ho, a visionary. I like it. Tell me more. Gladly, my dear fellow. My, my internet cut out I'm for listening like, to him. Like a good <laughs> moment of vulnerability, we made ourselves an enemy. But by mastering our fear and insecurity and handing over our power, we've begun a journey to something so much deeper. Uh, thanks, DJ, for the fucking tier one gift sub. Just to have some fun. That's fair. And congrats to Twemina for the for the gift. I like journeys. Traveling is a bit of a passion of mine. It makes me so relatable. Now, where are we off to? Well, if we're lucky, it's a journey to love. She hates us. I got good news for you, She Smith. hates us. Does she? She hesitated before stabbing us to death. How do you know? Because you can see. It's ridiculous. <laughs> see it. Yeah. So maybe he has a point. I don't know if I necessarily buy into his whole love journey thing, but... Jesus, DJ, thanks for the second gifted sub, and congrats to Mandodo for the gift. Maybe she won't be as keen to betray us this time. We've already proven to her that we can change, so maybe she'll realize that things don't have to end in violence. Now I have a sub. You know, maybe you're right. In which case, I suppose the only thing to do is to get back to the cabin and give it another try. Feel bad I didn't go to them, Lamel. Give what another try, exactly? You are aware I've been listening to you, right? We don't care about you. It makes no difference. The it's just been irrelevant this whole time. <laughs> He's been side... He's been sidebarred. We are cycle and whisking her away to freedom. Oh, are you now? Great. So you've obviously been here before. since Twice, actually. Sure. Twice. Then I'll spare you the little introduction I had planned. You already... I don't care. Don't care, don't Silently care. Silently proceed to the cabin. It isn't long before Thorns. you find yourself at the base of the cabin. I think it is the thorn. The, the thorn, point. after all. I don't know if I'd say everyone. Are you talking about me? I have a position. It's a good one, too. Ignore him, he's just talking for talking's sake. My position is the only one that matters. The Shut princess up. princess is a threat to you. She's a threat to me. <laughs> no, she loves me. Importantly, she's a threat. You know, to I world. love the uh, the uh, implication <laughs> that every voice in your head, besides like the hero, well, technically the hero, every voice in your head has just been a past you. So technically speaking, the smitten is you. I don't, I don't want to think about that. <laughs> Proceed to the cabin. 
The interior Whoa, of the cabin is pretty. hardly an interior at all anymore. Wait, the mirror. Burned out ruins merely suggest the shape of the structure that yeah. once stood here. Charred wood. I love that this is that it's just but beneath it it's so pretty. This is so pretty. After rain, the it, promise it, of it's got the red. In the, wreckage the only time you see red is like you know blood. Yeah. Flowers grown and, from and the that's for the roses. For the flowers grown flowers. from the blood of soil. Yeah. Flowers grown in bloody soil brews bloody flowers. The only mm. furniture of note is the crisp shell of what was once a table. There's no knife anymore. A pristine. Wait, this isn't right. This is supposed to be a pristine blade. Why isn't there a pristine blade? We, we gave it to her last time. She can't still have it. Can she? Well, she didn't die, and we did, and she stays around. Well, it's not here. And if she has it, let me guess. You want to get all chummy with her. Look, as far as I see it, if it's between him and her, I say we side with the one who has the weapon. It's just the smart thing to do. I wouldn't be so hasty. I'm sure the blade will turn up somewhere. She can't have it. That's not how this is supposed to work. If she does have it, that's all the more reason to put our faith in her. We've already shown her our heart. Now she has to show us hers. Unless her heart tells her to stab us, which doesn't seem unlikely. So, yes, I agree. Let's make sure we get on her good side. Approach the mirror. You step forward and approach the scorched entryway leading to the basement, hesitating before you begin the descent. You know what you have to do. Wipe away the grit from the mirror, and behold our handsome features. He really is Matt. It's Matt he from Ed's is. world. That makes me feel a little better. Wipe the mirror clean. Reach forward and wave your hand through the hollow entrance leading to the basement. What are you doing? Alas, our fine features also, remain unseen. Also, sometimes, like, I, like we'll shit cuts out for me for some reason. As beautiful as hmm? we are. Sometimes shit comes out for me for like a, like a second or two. Mm. Like well, sometimes, seems like, like the randomly. The only way to go is forward, isn't it? Yes, that's where everything tends to be. Let's just put on a good face and have our wits about us. Enter the basement. You step through the frame of scorched wood and make your way into the darkness below. The stairs to the basement are covered in a fine layer of gritty ash. The air still feels warm, as if the fires that ruined this place had only recently been extinguished. Yet fresh shoots of thorny branches are already weaving themselves through the soot-covered earth of the walls around you. Their spines point courteously down towards the basement, so you're able to brush past their jagged points with ease, at least on the way down. But you don't need to think about the way back up just yet. That's a matter for after the world's been saved. These thorns are an expression of her pain. I know it. She's calling out for help. Her voice, worn down by pain and suspicion, hobbles up the stairs. I can't get away from you, can I? You betray me, I kill you, and you come back. You let me kill you, and you come back. I don't know why you let me do that. I don't know what you want from me. I want to figure out a way out of here for good. I don't know what I want. I never really choose to come here. I want to free you. I mean it. I just want to talk. Really talk. Oh, these are all good options. Fuck. For real. Oh my god. I love this route. I love this route. Don't spoil it. Don't spoil it. Fuck. I won't. I won't. Fuck. Okay. Um. I don't know what I want. I never really choose to come here. I want a way to figure out how you're for good. I want to free you. I mean it. What can that grass thing do, though? They're thorns. Um. I. I want to figure out a way out of here for good. I think you know how this goes. I'm down here and I can't leave. So, come down and talk. It's not like I can stop you. Proceed down the stairs. You continue down the basement stairs. Brushing past 6 .1 the out of 10. You haven't thorns, even seen her. More more He's talking about the thorns. You don't even know what the thorn looks like. Oh, uh, <laughs> the thorns themselves. You step out oh. of what was once a vast open oh, cavern. Oh, you poor thing. Now overrun by briars and prickles and thistles. The space thick with hostile vegetation. At 
the heart of it all, encased in a tight weave of vines, is the princess, her bloody, trembling hands clutching a pristine blade. Did you know this was going to happen to me? Are you here to watch me suffer? Are you here to laugh? Oh. Yeah, I'm here to laugh. What did you think would happen after you killed me? Did you think he wouldn't hold it against you? I'm not. <laughs> Why is that the first That's option? That's fucked. The first option is. <laughs> Fuck you. I'm not here to laugh. I'm here to free you if you'll let me. I. I want to trust you. Her grip tightens on the blade. But you're hiding something, aren't you? Why would you help me if you weren't helping yourself? Smitten's gonna say something. Oh, he's not. You're not the only one who yearns for freedom. I'm trapped. I'm as trapped as you are. I think we need to leave together. The princess clutches the blade closer to her chest. That sounds nice. I'm so tired of the bad blood between us. But it's hard to let it go. Shit. You've hurt me. Oh, God, this hurts a little too hard. Her eyes yeah. dart away from yours for a brief moment. And I've also hurt you. Is there nothing I could say to change your mind? I guess I don't have anything left to say. Turn and leave. Fine, if you're going to be like that, I'm going to leave. Have a nice life. Turn and leave. Turn and leave. Is there nothing I can say to change your mind? I... I don't know. What can either of us really say at this point? How can we trust something as hollow as words? She's right. There's nothing left to say. So let's get a move on and do something before she comes up with a scheme to get out of here on her own. We don't need words to send a message. It is through action that we can show her our adoration, our devotion, our kindness. Then maybe it's time for either of us to say anything. All that counts is action. You reach towards her bloodied hands, laying your palm on her trembling fingers. For a moment, she clutches it even tighter, her knuckles going white with the effort. But then the tension fades. Her grip finally loosens and she allows you to take the weapon. You carefully pull it free from the thorns that they scrape at your skin, leaving red trickles of fresh blood all along your arms. She trusts us. She trusts us. Doesn't that set your heart a flutter? Yeah, a little. It could just be nerves. Being this close to her does bring back unpleasant memories, but I don't know. It doesn't feel bad. It feels good. Like we're special to her. She's so pretty. We are special to have gained an ounce of trust from a maiden so guarded. Now all that remains is to free her from her bindings. Yeah, let's do it. Let's show her how much both of us have changed. Or, hear me out, we slay her. Right here, right now. She's never been Shut so the fuck up, Shut up, opportunist. <laughs> okay, Smitten is now no longer my- We don't my... like you. <laughs> Hate for Smitten has ended. <laughs> opportunist is my new Hayden. That sounds like a <laughs> splendid idea. <laughs> Except for the narrator. Hatred. Fuck the narrator. I see that the lines have been drawn. <laughs> Fuck the narrator. It's two against one. It's two against two. You don't count. Hell yeah. Uh, and why shouldn't he count? <laughs> Do I want to give her a hug? She's in thorns, guys. Hell, you gotta wait. Because he's gay. Because he's clearly not I would, one of us. He's clearly not one of us. He's gay. <laughs> He's been with us what the whole us? time. What you should get us. a sec. So, did you mean it? Well, what about us, I'm huh? Fool to hand my life to you. I just Arr. wanted my blade black. You're on your own. <laughs> Damn. Cut her free. What a good idea. Let's cut her free. Oh, so you're suddenly team free her. You can't just switch sides as soon as we make a decision. No matter how bad it would hurt, she needs some help, and I don't care if it hurts me, I want to help her. That is such a me Based and you- That is such a me and you thing to say. We both would fucking say that. I can do whatever Dude, I, I want. Say that I, too, man, you know that I love her. I love the thorns so much. I wish I got that poster 
Everyone deserves a chance at redemption. Let him join us and be merry. We are all united by our passion. That's right. What he said. We've already given him a chance at redemption. And who says I don't deserve another? I really mean it this time. I'm big enough to admit when I'm wrong. So I want to help you all free her. And I have no problem with that. Welcome to the team. You're one of us now. One of the... Bro thinks he's part of the team. Shut up. Opportunist is not a part of the team. Shut up. Take the blade to the thorny vines imprisoning the princess and she flinches. Relaxing only slightly as the blade slices into the thick vegetation rather than her arm. And she flinches again as the last of the vines is cut away as if, after all of that, she's still expecting you to turn on her and stab her in the heart. But you're not going to do that, are you? Still, all it would take is a single slip of the blade. Such a pathetic attempt at distraction and subterfuge. Our blade is a dashing sword, and every dashing sword is an extension of its hero. It won't slip. You're right. He can't even make it slip, can he? He's a bit of a nobody. Good thing I've been on your side of all this since the beginning. Fucking liar. Shut the fuck up! The princess falls into your arms, tears streaking down her cheeks. I can't believe you're making me describe this. I hate you. Yeah! There's the second yeah. one. Is that this? Is that the only time he says that, except for the uh, the other one? I I think there's like another. There's one more time, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> oh, there's oh and oh and I hate you percent. Eight percent oh, speed run. That that's a really good idea for a speed run. <laughs> but also, there's a there's gonna be one more uh, great part of this part. I, okay, well, like, okay. If we when we're close to it, don't say anything. I want to experience this. Oh, we're close to it. Don't say anything about it. Right. You actually meant it. You rescued me. Do you see the way she's looking at us? Kiss her. Kiss her now before the moment ends. This is why we got the smitten. Do we kiss her? I'd say so. Oh, damn it. Okay. Here we go, chat. Can we actually do that? No, you can't. Absolutely not. You know as well as I do that we can. <laughs> yeah, Matt, let's do this. <laughs> and we wouldn't want to throw away a chance for a special moment now, would we? If I were only capable of throwing myself off a bridge. <laughs> well, are you going to describe our steamy, romantic kiss? Oh my god, please. You lean in, and you kiss her. And... And she reciprocates enthusiastically. You kiss. It's done. Are you happy now? Come on now. This is the big moment. You can do better than that. Ugh, fine. You and the princess lock eyes and stare deep into each other's souls with all the roaring emotion that comes from letting what once was hatred turn into pure, unbridled passion. Are you making fun of us? And then each of you close your eyes and kiss words can describe neither the nuclear fire nor the oceanic depth of your connection please i think he actually likes romance if history itself were not about to end historians would document this moment for the rest of time musicians would write era defining <coughs> ballads and great artists She's would spend so entire lifetimes trying to merely capture the spark you hold right now he's making fun of us it doesn't matter either way because this is good stuff it really is, Matt. I'm aware of my skills. Oh, that's cool. You want to know? You want to know the coolest thing too? It doesn't last forever. You open your eyes. This is the only rap where you can kiss her. Time for you to damn the whole world oblivion, I suppose. Not even with the damsel, the one where it's like, oh, romance, romance, romance. No kissing there. Because no, because this one feels real. This, this one, one is feel so real. It's so it's, it's so real. Like, and it's also and it's as, also why I told you to bring the smitten. <laughs> and because, like, I don't know if I I can't speak for everyone in chat, but as someone who's been betrayed time and time again, it's so hard to accept that someone just genuinely wants to be there for you. And those people do exist; they're out there. It's just you. I, 
I just... Fuck, man. Even in a romantic setting, I've been betrayed so many times. And it's so hard to think that someone is looking out for me. That someone wants to be there for me. And there is people like that. There really is. Not just romantic interests. Friends. Families. Especially friends. And... <laughs> It's this, I haven't seen it described this well in, ever. The way you betray someone and the way they betray you back and yet you still give them the chance at redemption. And... Fuck, dude. <laughs> Fuck. Time for you to damn the whole world to oblivion, I suppose. I don't care. <sighs> that was nice. Her hand slips into yours and the two of you rush to the basement stairs. Shameful, really, that the same thorns that so graciously allowed you downstairs are now blocking your only way out. Please, after all the trials we've been through, do you really think a few measly thorns can stop us? Love it's real close to home, doesn't it, Abby? You of all people know why. I won't get into it. Kind, just fine, they're only thorns. I'm not afraid of getting a few scrapes. I'm not even sure we need to do any cutting. We can just move them out of the way. What a pathetic showing, really. A few pointy sticks can't keep us down here. We're both meant for so much more than this. Wait, what? Hold on. Why do I have a choice you can, here? You can... I, I don't think it really matters. You can't just step into them and it's like, oh yeah, I'm fine. Um... I don't want her to get hurt, so I'm just going to cut the thorns. As you swing your blade into the thorns covering the basement stairs, they yield. Both you and the princess ascend the stairs without obstacle. This is unacceptable. The second you step out of this cabin with her, the world ends. Do you hear me? What did the world ever do to you to deserve this? Locked her down there. Made me betray her made me fucking ruin her and make her feel like she wasn't worthy of acceptance or love. All I can say is fuck the world at this Your point. Your nightmare is our dream. Whatever world would condemn star-crossed lovers like us to a cycle of violence and despair isn't a world worth saving. We'll weave something new together. Something better. You and the princess hesitate at the cabin door. This is your last chance. We've already made our decision. We're finally leaving here together, aren't we? And all we had to do was trust each other. It wasn't easy, but I'm glad we finally could. Step into your freedom. Hands clasped, oh. the two of you open the door and it's step so out pretty. into a new day. Can you press H real quick so you can get a screenshot? I can do that. Yeah, you press H, and then you can just get a <gasps> screenshot of this. That's so cool! Yeah. There was a, they, is the screenshot a S12? Yeah. It is. Okay. It just took a little bit. For the uh, They made a poster of this scene, of this little particular part. This is so fucking pretty. Holy shit. I know. I, I just... I saw a poster of this, and I'm like... Either I saw a poster of this, or I saw, like, uh, RT Games' uh, thumbnail was this. And I'm like, fuck, yeah. that's really pretty. I think this is the true ending. And it's like, uh, it's probably not. It's not the true ending, but it might as well be. Holy shit. Mm -hmm. Two of you open the doors, step into a day. You're irredeemable murderers. What do we do now? We wait. Well, where is everything going? Please don't think Why I did this. So cold? Please don't think I did this. I, I'm sorry. Bye. You not get the chance to respond, nor will you ever. Oh, they're still selling the poster. I thought they like sold out of this, dude. They're still selling the poster. Shit, they are. Fuck, I gotta buy that. Same, same. Wait, hold on. Go? Wait, chat. Stop everything. We're buying the poster. <laughs> Slave of princess. Thorn poster. Thorn poster. Thorn poster. I'm gonna have to wait for my next paycheck, but yeah. I spelled Thorn wrong, it's Thrawn. <laughs> it's twenty dollars. 
Here, by popular demand, everyone's favorite shot of everyone's favorite princess, the thorn. And this time, nobody's gonna take her away from you. I'm really glad I got you into this game. <laughs> I'm really glad you convinced me to do it again. Yeah. I never would have, like, experienced this. Oh, there's that mirror again. Why is it here? Why now? Approach the mirror. This, this, yes, if they think it's bad, I'm... The voices feel small, distant as you approach, gaze into my reflection. You've unraveled. Are those always the same? Can I change those or no? Uh, no. Okay. They, they, they're just always, like, the same. Okay. You find yourself in long quiet once again, proceed to the cabin. It's just showing the progression of how many, like, vessels are left. Mmm, okay, okay. And after this point, it's just one left. You're at the cabin. The up There's this update is really like oh. the endless walls of the long quiet. We're supposed to be there. Do you know what we'll find out there? Is that a rhetorical this question? This update does like mostly end game stuff, like the like the final thing that we'll see. Do you think there's anything real out there? Do you think we're real? Do you have thoughts on this vessel? This one yearns for connection she feels she doesn't deserve. Even oh. when shown compassion, she hid herself away. She will make for a cautious heart. Okay, you don't gotta call me out, Shifting Mound. Do not <laughs> mourn her. She isn't alone anymore. She is with you. And, and with a bunch of hands, but still. And the other ones. That too. If this is the last stage before your completion, then I'm not going back. I'm just going to stay here forever if I have to. How many more vessels do I need to bring you? When you send me back, I'm not alone. There are voices that speak to me. Some of them are my, some of them are me, but some of them is something else. I call him the narrator, and he wants me to kill you. Do you have a narrator? Has the vessels had one? No. Their thoughts are quiet. Do you think your narrator lives in the spaces beyond? My god, this game just fucking read Abby's soul? Damn. Dox me. <laughs> he does. I don't know why, but I know it's true. He does. I don't know what I'm going to do with him when I find him. He does. And when I find him, you and I are finally going to have answers. He does. And when I find him, I'm going to kill him. He does. But you're going to keep that to yourself. He does. And when I find him, I'm going to kill him. If he drives you towards my destruction, then he is steeped in delusion. For he does not know me. Just as I hold compassion for you, and you hold compassion for me, you can hold compassion for those who have wronged you. Redo her voice lines? Abby lives at 723412 Alabaster Street, Wayne County, Wayne County, Texas. You live in Texas too? Shit, you're not you're my neighbor. <laughs> I think they doxed you instead, Dave. I think they got the wrong ah, one. Ah shit! Ah shit! <laughs> Legal name is Abby Laboratory. I Abby wish. G it's Abby Gale, specifically spelled A B B Y G. -A -Y That's a reference to the highlight video. That's a reference, guys. Editor, reference play, editor, play the entire highlight video in the face of the vessel here, but like speed it up so much so where no one can see it, and then just like pause it on that single frame and then speed it up again. <laughs> That's, that's, that's going to be a fucked up idea. Why did you say that? <laughs> Get fucked, editor, man. I'm right here. I know. Uh, I'm ready to go back. The next time I see you, each of us will finally know what we are. I'm going to go pee real quick. Okay. All right, shit. You guys want to see some things I've been doing? Lately, so uh, recently, I have been collecting Scott the Waz trading cards. Hey, let me go get my binder. Actually, I got I got like the whole binder of them. I don't have them all yet, but I think that it's. I never play the clip where Abby is dying. Which one? From the big mom? Oh, that one. Yeah. Yeah, I'll definitely keep that one in mind. 
Uh, yeah, let me show you guys my, my Scott the Waz cards so, so far. So I don't have a lot, but like I think I have a, about half. Oh, this one's a lot of, this one's really good. I really want that one. I really want, I really hope I get the first one. Oh, this one's really funny. Oh, y'all are going to love this one. Oh, you see that one? <laughs> That's such a good reference. I love these Scott the Waz cards. Uh, that one, oh, that one's like my worst card. I really don't like that card. I have like, a, like 500 of that same card. Uh, and this did you card, play oh. the clip where Abby's dying from the big mommy? Great. <laughs> Hey, Abby, welcome back. I was telling your chat about my Scott the Waz trading card collection. Based? I will be here, waiting for you. I only have like half of them so far. The hero and the princess. It's the last one. You're on a path. You're here. Which one do you recommend that I do? Which one? Um, now that I think about it, I think there's only been one that, like, one big one that you haven't done. How do so, I get to her? It doesn't matter what you do here, the like whether or not you pick up this knife, implement. it's up to you. You'll need Actually, there's two main ones you didn't find, but I, I prefer the, one of them. So it doesn't it's matter? It doesn't matter here. I'm entering the basement. The door to pub is actually... Hi, entering, entering the basement actually might have been a bad idea. Do you want us to restart? No, no, no. You'll have an opportunity to leave, don't worry. Okay. Okay. Um, what do I do? Uh, good, keep her locked away. <laughs> I shouldn't have directly said it. Nah, it's fine. That seems like a pretty good compromise. I don't think I could bear being down here that much longer. Leaving her alive is too risky. If you don't deal with her soon, she will find a way out. So I'm the only one who liked that idea. <sighs> well, I mean... One way or another, I'm going to find a way out of here. It would make it easier for oh. both of us if you'd help. Hello. But if you don't, I can promise that you'll regret that decision. This is new. Yeah. You have to make a choice. Let's hope for all our sakes, it's the right mm -hmm. one. Retrieve the blade. Let's get you out of here. Lock her in the basement. Uh, which? I, ju I just, like, repress that motherfucker. Lock her in the basement? Yeah. <laughs> Bye. I know you think this is some kind of fair compromise, but it isn't. No one wins here. Oh, that's in bold. That's new. It's a chance we'll have to take. We can make this work if we just stay here and keep watch. No one has to die. She's pissed off. She's so upset. I don't know what's wrong with her. Where are you going? You can't just leave me here. You turn your back to the princess and make your way back to the stairs. Ghost ending? No, we got that last time. Fine. Yeah. Turn your back on me, but it won't be long before I slip these chains. And once I'm out of here, there will be hell to pay for leaving me behind. Slip these chains? She can't, right? She needed our She could chew her arm off. Yeah. Do you hear the conviction in her voice? I don't think she's bluffing. Either way, she dropped the mask, didn't she? You the can mask, still grab huh? the blade and get back down here. I think I know what you're talking about. No, we're sticking to the plan and locking her away, or that's a relief. I was afraid I already committed to not slaying her. <laughs> uh, I, I just lock her away, right? Yeah, you just keep her down there. It'll be the death of all of us, but fine. We'll do it your way. You close the basement door, locking it behind you and quickly barricading it with the heavy wooden table that once held the blade. Okay. Wait, the blade's gone. We can make this work. Yeah, where the fuck did it go? It just, like, disappeared. That's what the point of the mask is. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. I'm timing DJ out. I can't time DJ out because he's a mod, and then that'll revoke his mod privileges. Ban him. No. <laughs> he's the only active member. <laughs> this is just, like, the cut on the, uh, on the what's-her-face. Uh, I don't know. The adversary. The cut was missing when she killed me. Watch. 
Oh yeah, true. You settle in against the far wall to watch the base. Then some the simp was like, oh yeah, I like, licked her wounds. That was you. I'm so fucking tempted to leave. <laughs> <laughs> but it was you. Right? It was uh, you? Yes. <laughs> yeah, okay. It isn't long before deny. you start to drift off, your eyelids heavy with fatigue. But sleep doesn't come. Instead, your rest is broken by a piercing, wailing voice calling out to you from the other side of the door. I know you're still there. <gasps> Why don't you make things easier on yourself and let me out? It's not like this little door will hold for very long anyways. Huh? It's probably a good idea to try to get back on my good side. She sounds terrified. Like she's less of the princess you saw and more like something out of a nightmare. A As nightmare, she huh? She rattles the door. You do your best to shut her out of your mind. When I get out of here, I'm going to pick you apart piece by piece. I will forget what you did, and I will never forget it. You don't know the kind of enemy you've made tonight. It doesn't sound like she's getting any weaker. Ooh. No, it doesn't. Third meal you want, all it takes is all it does is ease my guilty conscience. So all that was just an act, wasn't it? You're not really an innocent or harmless. You're not even a princess, you're a monster. Ignore her and go to sleep. That sounds like the only bad option here. Oh god. When the fuck did I go down with that amount of money? It's because of fucking Nintendo, of course. <laughs> I didn't pay my Nintendo bills. <laughs> you're not really innocent or harmless. You're, you're not even a princess. You're ignore her and just go to sleep. Ignore her. Maybe the banging and wailing will stop if you just don't pay attention to it. Put the princess's threats out of your mind as best you can and huddle up against the wall. You jolt awake oh, God. the night to silence in the cabin. The ruckus has stopped. And the door to the basement is ajar. It's lock broken and the table shoved out of the way. Where is she? Oh god, wait, where is she? Thanks for <gasps> helping me get out of that awful basement. What the fuck? You try and stumble to your feet, but as the princess draws near, it's as though your body simply stops working. It isn't all at once. The paralysis comes in waves. First your toes go numb, and then your feet. And then your legs. You lie prone on the floor of the cabin, unable to do anything but witness her approach. Whose side are you on? Yours, of course. But I have a duty to uphold the truth. Lying about the facts of the situation doesn't change them. Ghost Princess Wood times ten? No, that's a different route. So helpless. Yeah, I would uh, same, but like, like, you, the, the, like unrelated. She steps closer, Ugh. one silent footfall at a time, cocking her head in curiosity as you feel your organs shutting down one by one. Or maybe I can't take my time with you. You don't look well. A little green around the gills. What a shame. If you'd only helped me get out of here, we could have done such wonderful things together. Your lungs stop drawing in breath, and your heart freezes in your chest. You have seconds left. I'd say better luck next time. But we both know this is the end. Don't we? It can't be. This can't actually be how everything ends. I'm sorry, but it is. Everything goes dark. And you die. The nightmare? Uh-oh. Wait, this is the thing Dave was hinting at! You're on a path, yeah. you're here to s Proceed to the cabin. Bend the nightmare, oh you control she it. Will lie, she will cheat, and she will do Artful everything dodger. in her power Easy to does stop it. you from slaying her. I don't think lying and cheating is a thing. She was- it doesn't matter. Don't trust anyone. Uh, he's paranoid. Yeah. Oh no, this? This is worrying? I'm worried too, chat. Dave's the only one that knows, and he's not gonna tell me. 
Oh, I'm not going to tell you a thing. Oh. You're, this is up to the you at this point. Of the wall was almost featureless. The only furniture... Dave, turn the lights off. off. You got my reference! Yeah! A pristine blade stands between you... I don't get open, it. Inviting it's a, it's a Stanley Hall song. Oh, yeah. The blade is your implement. You'll need it if you want to do this. There are eyes in the window. Hold on. There are eyes in the window. There are eyes in the fucking window. Guys, are we not gonna talk about the eyes in the window? It's just an empty <laughs> frame. It's maybe like this is the shit whenever I was like, oh, like whenever I got high that one night. My first time getting high. Did I ever tell you that? No, you never told me much. anything about high. <laughs> the story time chat. Uh, the first time I ever got high, I was smoking weed with uh, with my brother or my sister. I don't really. What? My sibling. Uh, and. I was going, I took like a couple hits, and I even took like a couple things of edibles, and by the end of the night, every time I blinked, I saw eyes, and just eyes. All I saw was eyes, and things made of eyes, and buildings made of eyes, and people made of eyes. So eyes in horror have been ruined for me. Hmm. You do not recognize the eyes in the window, you do not recognize the bodies in the water. That's an SCP joke that I don't understand. She's already got now, hasn't she? And she's ready for us. She's been waiting. Can't you feel her eyes on us? You mean those eyes that are right there? <laughs> I'm going to need all of you to pull yourselves together. The princess has not already gotten out. But if you keep getting stuck in your head like this, you're going to struggle to get the job done. Burnt hair smells like peanut butter. So Interesting. deep breath in, deep breath out. Your task awaits, and only you can do it. You didn't say anything about the mirror. Of course, the mirror. Take the blade, enter the basement. Uh, we're not gonna talk about the, the eyes in the window? No? Okay. Should I take- Oh, fuck. Should I take the blade? Hey, it's up to you. There's an SCP which is a lake that has bodies in it, and it looks like people you know. If you recognize the bodies, you want to join them. Interesting. Interesting. Alright, quarter. Don't fail me now. Heads take the blade. Tails don't. I lost the coin. It's gone forever. Lovely. That's a reference! No, it's not. This is the thing I said. That's Tails. an Abby reference! We're not taking the- we're not taking the blade. Oh, we should have taken the knife. I don't think going down there unarmed is going to do us any favors. <sighs> you cross oh. over the threshold. Oh. Onto a series of isolated steps, suspended in darkness. This is kind of what it looks like, but more eyes. the eyes. The eyes, you never mentioned the yeah, eyes. seeping up from below reminds you of fresh lightning and static. As if you're descending into a place that isn't meant for a creature of flesh and blood. If the princess lives here, slaying her would probably be doing her a favor. Her cruel and playful voice prances up the stairs. I didn't think you'd come back. We're gonna have a lot of fun, you and I. This is the first ever route I've seen, she must by have the you way. Confused with someone else. Oh, really? It's like, yeah, I saw, like, Manly Badass Heroes, like, thing. I was like, oh, yeah, I, I saw that on Steam. I, I wonder what it's about. And then I, like, and then he plays this route, and I'm like, holy fuck, I need to get this game. You really don't remember, do you? It doesn't matter. We need a game plan. We know we can't just go down there unprepared. I'm going to talk to her. We don't need a plan. I'm just going to kill her. Mr. Narrator seems to think... I can do it. I don't know why you're all being such pessimists right now. Step off into the void between the stairs. Continue down the stairs in silence. Oh my god! What a... I'm going to talk to her. Uh, it's, uh... Oh. All right. Um... I'm gonna flip two coins. Heads, talk to her. Heads, step off into the void. Heads, talk to her. Tails, talk at, uh, talk at, uh, the void. I don't know where that coin went. I'm gonna flip a new one. I don't know where that coin went either. Fuck, I'm bad at catching coins. You need Tails, to step into the void. <laughs> step into the void. Your attempts to step off the stairs and into the pitch black surrounding them 
You're stopped by an invisible force. Why did you do that? What did you think would happen? Uh, oh, well, uh, the coin. I was curious. I don't know. Falling into an info would seem better than going downstairs and dying. I'm just scared. Say nothing. You make your way to the bottom of the stairs. As you emerge, Ooh. you find yourself between two loose rows of white wooden planks suspended in nothingness. A smattering of cobblestones visible against the inky black of the basement mark where the floor should be, forming vague pathways. At what seems to be the end of the room, they diverge in opposite directions, left and right. She could be anywhere, and there's nowhere for us to hide. We're completely exposed. Are you really not going to comment on how weird this place is? No, I'm not. Somebody needs to be the voice of reason here, and it certainly isn't you. I miss the Excuse goddess. Me. I'm being me too. incredibly reasonable. You're the one who's just matter-of-factly describing whatever the hell we're looking at like it's an ordinary basement. Have you noticed how much I am desperate for her? I Yeah, I'm the same amount of desperate. We're going to die down here. I don't want to die again. Please stop saying that. You're only going to make things worse. Just pick a direction and start moving. I wouldn't give it too much thought if I were you. It doesn't really matter. Because either way you go, I'm going to find you. Oh, uh, my brother's playing Stardew Valley. Go left, go right, do nothing, go back the way you came. Oh my god. Mm. It really doesn't matter. It I, really doesn't matter. I'm sure it doesn't, but right, right's always right. You turn to the right. A faintly outlined path lies before you. There you are. <gasps> I told you I was going to find you. As the princess approaches, Hi. your legs suddenly go numb. Your arms quickly follow. This is it. This is just you this being so nervous. I, yeah. yeah. I'm nervous, but I'm also like... She's so pretty. It's almost like you want me to get you. I don't like that her face looks like a doll. Right isn't always right. They're wrong on trans people, for example. Oh my god, you're right. I should have gone with left. 2 a.m. here. I'm going to sleep. Good night, chat. Good night. Good Hopefully your dreams night. are better than whatever the fuck I'm in. I sure hope you don't deal with the nightmare. Way out of this. Think. Think. What did you do? Pull yourself together. She isn't supposed to be like this. Wood? Yeah. Same. Abby has the fear boner? Okay. I wonder how many times I'll get to play with you before you break. As your blood begins to coagulate, it's as if every part of your being is coming to a lurching halt. Heart. Lungs. Liver. He constantly repeats that, by the way. Heart. Your lungs pull in a desperate <gasps> gulp of air as your eyes shoot back open. Heart. What are you doing? I'm working. Do you want this body to function, or do you want... Okay, whatever you were doing, please just start doing it again. Are you sure about that? Are you sure that's what you want, or do you want to interrupt me some more? You have seconds left. Yes, I'm sure. Again, your eyes shoot open as you gasp for breath. You can't decide what you want to do, can you? Oh well, standing there gasping like a fish is more fun than dead. Even if you look ridiculous. She isn't attacking us. Why? The why doesn't matter. She's already proven her ill intent. Don't lose sight of your mission. And how are we supposed to do that? We don't have a weapon. The way out of here is nowhere to be seen. That isn't my fault. It doesn't matter whose fault it is because fighting her isn't an option right now. And you should get looking, shouldn't you? Why won't you finish me off? Because I don't want to. And even if I did, oh, I don't have to. Look at the way you're struggling to stay alive. It's taking everything you have to keep your heart pumping right now. And I'm enjoying the show. The princess leans forward, bringing her masked lips close to your ear. 
If I want to see you die, all I need to do is break your concentration. Heart, lungs, liver, nerves. She slowly runs her velvet glove across the base of your neck. It feels like static. And then... Hey, snap out of it. Wait, shit, I didn't get to see it. Shit, 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 make her stop. Oh, fuck. He's okay. autistic. Deep breath. Deep breath. We're fine. Heart. Lungs. Liver. Nerves. Heart. You're back. Lungs, liver, One moment. Nerves, heart, and then lungs, you're gone. Liver, nerves, Just heart, like lungs, that. Liver, that. Nerves, heart, ah. Lungs, and liver, there's the fear. Heart. She pulls away. Nerves, but that heart, wouldn't be very lungs, fun, now liver, would it? Nerves, I've already heart, done that. He's just like me for real. His autism gets triggered by fucking static. Heart, lungs, Damn. Nerves, heart, lungs, liver, nerves. You're a lunatic. You know that, right? What's happened after you killed me last time? I believe while you suffocated, but that stupid cabin wouldn't let me. So I started to drag your body out with me, and then, well, you died before I could get to the door. And then I was here, and now you are here too. I don't think I can move without you, and dead doesn't count. And as much as I love what we have going on, I have bigger plans than tormenting one poor little creature forever. I want to leave. If you need me alive, then why'd you threaten me on the stairs? Why didn't you try being nice to me? I am being nice. You're alive, aren't you? And you died of fright as soon as you saw me last time. I didn't think keeping you alive was an option. But it looks like that's not a problem anymore. At least not for me. You seem miserable. I've sent you to stop between destroying the world. I can't just let you leave. And if I let you out, what then? Do we go our separate ways? Oh, no, definitely not. If you're what I need to leave this place, chances are you're pretty useful. I think I'll keep you right by my side. A little good luck charm to make sure I stay free. Don't worry. I'll make sure to take good care of you. I promise. If you want to work together, can you at least turn off this whole organ shutting down situation? I am what I am. It's not my fault that you can't handle being around me. And what if I refuse to let you out? What happens then? We don't have to be enemies. We can work together. We can be friends even. Run? I don't think we can run. Oh, God. It's up to you. I, uh, do you want a recommendation or do you just want to like... A recommendation. Uh, you, know, you know what they say, if you love a woman, you stick with her. That's, no one said that ever. Okay, let's get out of here. No! <laughs> That's not what I meant! <laughs> that Wait! Works. What? You said stick is, with her! Yeah, that's the. as it remained with your nightmare! Oh my god, Dave. It would have been some exist. You would have seen some existential bull. Some existential fucking nuts. Nuts wacky shit if you did. In other words, your body stops moving. Do you think you could just wrest control away from us? Stay with your nightmare, El Bozo. Doesn't the world end if we fail to stop her? Won't letting us die here just make it end faster? Shit. Lungs, liver, nerves, heart, lungs, liver. With a flick of the princess's wrist, the stairs slide back into place. I can't believe you're making me watch, you damn everyone, to torment and oblivion. Come along now. You don't want to be stuck down here. The princess glides onto the stairs and beckons you to follow. If only you had a weapon, this would be the part we don't. We can still grab it on the way out. You're not true. wrong, but maybe you should let me handle the suggestions for the time being. Just focus on keeping us alive. <laughs> right. Heart. Lungs. Step onto the stairs and follow the princess. You step onto the basement stairs, following the princess as she ascends. Pins and needles punctuate your every step, an uncomfortable and constant reminder of your mortality. Is this really worth it? At least, it's a choice. 
That doesn't justify anything. A terrible choice is still terrible. Make sure you keep up. We wouldn't want you to fall. Um, as if acting on instinct, you crane your neck and look behind you. There is nothing there. Except the eyes! Princess yeah. reaches the top of the stairs and taps on the door. Her head twists back in your direction, watching you with dead eyes as the way out creaks open. Don't forget that your pristine blade is still on the other side. You can still make this right. You can still save everyone. You can still save yourself from becoming her What if I kill myself? Pet. Never. There's no harm in us having a weapon. All it does is give us more options, and we are dangerously low on those right now. Um, have you considered maybe you could operate the autonomic nervous system for a bit? Everyone is trying to manipulate us, and I can only do so many things at once to keep us alive. Um, heart. Um, liver? Your body seizes violently as you regain consciousness on the floor of the cabin. No, no, no! You're doing it all wrong! You're supposed to do it like this. Heart, lungs, liver, nerves, heart. I guess I have to do everything around here, don't I? Heart, lungs, liver, nerves. Now we go back with me where you belong. I thought you might have decided to break yourself just to spite me. It's better for you that you didn't. Now we can get back to business. For starters, we won't need this where we're going. The princess plucks the blade from the floor and tosses it through the door behind you. It vanishes into the inky black Shit. of the basement, never to be seen again. Shame. Guess we're not stabbing her in the back. I guess not. I'm going to fix myself a stiff drink. <coughs> if I'm about to watch you hand the world to her on a silver platter, I'd rather not be sober. And now, I get him. the door. There's nothing else for us to do. Step into the world. You could just like jump out into the fucking head. basement. Let your terrors loose up on the world. Beyond the cabin. Princess exhausted slumps to the ground. You not get the chance to respond, nor will you ever She's time gone. to leave. Is that a Approach the mirror? This this stuff is calling us. And not Gaze into the reflection. There's nothing there. That isn't right. Can't be nothing in focus view. You can see the figure faint and veiled in shadow just beyond the reflection. Are you I me? I think you know what I am. So one thing this update did... Oh no, the glass! Uh, one thing this update did, did is give you like a couple more like questions you can ask him. Not in terms of like the options, you just can ask him like two more questions now. But mm. you can just like destroy him like right off the bat. It's, like, I was I gonna... Shit. I was gonna do that. Yeah, go for that. It gets you an achievement too. <laughs> Destroy the mirror. Fuck! I don't need answers. You don't need answers from the thing that lives in the mirror. You already know what you are. You are the long, quiet, a vast and nascent god. And it's finally time for you to make up. All of this is you. Now it's time to see like the real like meat and potatoes of this update. You already know what you are. Proceed to the cabin one last time. When you arrive at the heart of things, there's no final vessel for you to bear witness to. There's nothing for you to find. Here they come. Hey. Hey, sexy. I'm back. I can finally You're see back you. again. What's good? You can finally see me. It's been so long, and my heart has ached for this moment. I've missed you dearly. I've missed you too. She unfurls an endless cascade of smiles in response, and then patiently waits for you to continue. 
I'm the long quiet, but I don't really know what that means. Names are their attempts to capture that which cannot be captured. They go. What happens now? Ever the passive player, always reacting and never acting. But it's woven into your nature, isn't it? When the Echo spun us from one into two, he gave you a choice and me a role to play. I am not death, but I contain it in my multitudes. So, will you attempt to destroy me and bring about a world devoid of death and the possibility of meaning? Or, will you open the final doors to our liberation? Uh... What's the new stuff? You gotta keep exploring. There's so many stories we've left unfinished. Can we really just leave? Even as your eyes begin to open, you still hold on to the notions of is and is not, of beginning and end. Pitch black islands in the blinding light of the infinite. There is nothing to resolve, nothing restraining us but us. Don't you have a say in all this? Why is it all falling on me? Of course I have a say in all of this. You and I share reflections of each other's burdens, just as you and I share reflections of each other's gifts. If we didn't, the winding paths that brought us here wouldn't have been full of strife and conflict. Let's talk this through. I still have so many questions and I need answers before I can make a choice. My very nature is paradox, as is yours. You cannot use words to grasp at things that are beyond their reach. And you cannot rationalize that which defies logic. Hold on. I'm... There we go. But violence and passion are dances that both of us know. Uh -oh. of. If this is what it takes to enlighten me, then so be it. It's time no. for the animation. Oh my god. This is new. Mm. pretends to protect us from loss. To fear death protects from losing a body. To fear ruin protects from losing status. To fear rejection protects from being known. This is a bad start to show the animations because she literally just teleports toward see. Oh, look at that. There's a... That's that's not... Oh, shit. That's not right. That's not... Hmm. This update sure is uh, finished. <laughs> that's... That's a bit odd. Uh... Losing a body is contained within having a body. Losing status is contained within having status. Being known is contained with being conscious. Of all things to transform, to go from known to hidden to known again. They just let's just ignore that. Just pretend it isn't there. But when the ceaseless impermanence of all things strips away the finality of endings, what remains of fear? Actually, check again. Is it a shelter protecting you from itself? I think it's her. <laughs> it, if, if it's just the nightmare, that's it's fucking. I have to like, we're gonna have to like report that. Here, I'll get onto the Steam page for it. <laughs> Expand. Address this vessel's statement directly. Appeal to your shared humanity. Speak about life and death and change stagnation. But isn't what any of this has been about. Shit, another update for Slay the Princess? I think there's like a little patch update for it. You speak about life and death and change and stagnation, but that isn't what any of this has been about. You've done nothing but lecture me since the minute I got here. You act as though the world can't exist without you, but I've existed without you. Reject yourself. I won't engage with violence. Address this vessel statement directly. That wasn't a rejection of fear. You broke me to your will. You wanted to make the world suffer. You act as if you're above it all, but you're not. I'm not afraid anymore. Even if I'm not afraid now, the fear of others is real. We can't uphold the harm that everyone suffers just because we're beyond it. Wait. Oh, God. Oh, God. What do I do? It's up to you. No, oh, I don't know what this means. It's like beyond my comprehension. <laughs> Honestly, fair. 
reject of reject her authority. You've done nothing but lecture me since I've been in that god here. Appeal to your shared humanity. You speak about life and death and change and stagnation, but that isn't what any of this has been about. Oh, is it me? Perhaps you can enlighten me. Oh is it mine? In some thoughts nurture forms that bleed the soul. And endless growth that blots your vision and strangles your trust. When I succumbed to myself, you patiently stood by me and cut the thistles that rooted in my skin. Your compassion is what freed us both, but compassion is a thing that must be nurtured, and you cannot nurture that which cannot change. If I had known what you really were, I wouldn't have been so quick to free. Of course I helped you. I didn't want us to hate each other. Oh, God. No, don't make me confront Thorn. Make out with her. That's the that's the perfect I response. wish there was a make out option. Uh, log. A thought is a vine, and some thoughts nurture thorns that bleed the soul. An endless growth you that bloats your vision. By the way... Hmm? How do you how do you do the uh, the spoiler text on a like a Steam discussion? I don't know. I think you can highlight it with hold left click and then right click and then there oh. should be a spoiler option. When I succumbed to myself, you patiently stood by me and cut the thistles that rooted in my skin. Your compassion is what freed us both. But compassion is a thing that must be nurtured, and you cannot nurture what cannot change. This has always been about us, two people forced to hurt each other again and again, but we don't have to hurt each other anymore. You cling to your emotion of pain and suffering. There is beauty in ugliness, and love in conflict. You are nothing. A black hole of self-loathing fed by the matter of oh, the Empress. thoughts. A dog yeah. lying to its leash. But there is no life without the dog. When I Hi. proclaimed my godhood and offered you a place at my side, you gladly became the instrument of my new creation. Only with both of us is there a future to look towards. It is hope that calls me into being. Because you have the shape. There can be love and conflict and beauty and ugliness between us without bringing the whole of reality into the picture. You act as though the world can exist without you, but I've existed without you. I won't engage with violence. I gladly became her pet bird, and I would do it again. Me too. Uh, address. I miss when that was... I miss when that was you. <laughs> Submitting to you was a mistake. I would have destroyed you if I knew who you were. You were consumed by your own ego. I miss when that was you. Oh, that sounds like something I'd say. Yeah. Uh, either appealed to shared humanity, there can be love and conflict and beauty and ugliness between us without bringing the whole reality into the picture. Or I missed one, that was you. This is like, I, I can't comprehend it, and yet I gotta fucking fight for it? Like, I don't understand what's happening. I know the last time I ended it early, but this time I kind of want to see it through. I would definitely recommend seeing it through, yeah. I miss when that was you. My threads, like yours, are unbroken. She is me as much as I was her. Ooh, the hands. The question of everything is to deny the truth in front of you. By believing in your suffering, you make your suffering real. By believing in your limitations, you placed a shackle on your neck. Bound for eternity, you saw the need for impermanence. And it was through that need that you carved our freedom. Without impermanence... That was honestly the best option uh, you had. Hmm? That was honestly the best option you had, like, uh, doing that. Like, sh shackling yourself. Because it was either killing her, or uh, she takes the knife and uh, gets the the shackle on her neck off, you could say. Mmm. 
Would you strip my gifts away and leave everyone to suffer in the dark? There can be love and conflict between you. Yes. They'll get over it. They'll see your end as a gift of time. That would be torture. Would you strip my gifts away and leave everyone to suffer in the dark? That would be torture. That would be torture. It would. Our purpose is to be and to experience. And their purpose is the same. To be permanent is to cease. To be paused is to be trapped. Ooh. Your life might have to stake into your body. And another, and another, and another. Do I miss your heart because I can't stand to see it go? Love melted in skepticism. <laughs> she looks so and fucking stupid. <laughs> <laughs> and you the knowledge that you did not know me. She looks like you, you drew her from a. She looks. She, she looks like, looks like I added her in myself. Like a, she looks like uh, like whenever you go to the library and pick up like a how to draw manga book. Shut up. <laughs> My hiding from now is within your grasp. I have no desire to hide, but the truth can be made better. If destroying you is what it takes, it'll be I don't want to hide from the truth. Then don't. I'm ready, I don't want to leave you. I won't leave with you if you want to see more. I won't leave with you, not until you've seen things from my perspective. If you need more time to break my mind, then I will give you. As the clash between you abates, you begin to shake, your will rapidly dissolving. Nothing is immutable. Everything that is exists only in relation to everything that isn't. There is no constant. There is no center. Open your eyes and accept what we are. We can leave this prison together. It's easy to believe the things you believe in when you get to sit above it all. What do you think happens if we leave here? This universe dies, and a new one is born. And that one dies, and a new one is born. And you and I get to witness it all, weaving a tapestry of life wherever we go. It's easy to believe the things you believe in when you sit above it all. It is from my vantage point that I can see the totality of truth. I never wanted to fight you, but how do we leave? Oh. Nothing brings me what do you mean, oh? Than to hear those words. Uh, you get the same ending as before, shit. Damn it! Yeah. Fuck! Hold on! Did I save before this? I don't think you did. Shit. I'm so sorry. You should have steered me away from it, Dave! Listen, I, I, listen, I don't know- I, Listen, I don't know every single little bit of this game. It's a really cool, it's a really fucking, like, good game, but I don't know everything about it. Free yourself. This en this ending is still fucking m miraculous, though. It yeah. is one of my favorites. Body of an ancient creature from its hibernation. You feel your wings. Glass of your cage presenting in you, but it's not yield. What happens now? Everything. Just like it always has been. And just like it always will be. Step into the infinite. If you want to, like, reload a save file and then just, like, yap, yap, yap city through everything else to get another ending, I'm, I, I'd be down to see that. Nah, it's, it's 130. That's fair. Well, you'll never know fear and you fear finally home. Next time, I promise. The next time we. Hell yeah. Join, join the Discord. Join our mailing list. Join the subreddit. Follow us somewhere else. Make your playlist. Play our other game. You should uh, go to the main menu and just sit there for a bit. Okay. Let's just talk about the game. Good game. Good game. As always. Goochie, goochie, goo. Goochie goochie goo! Don't buy your tickets! Goochie goochie goo! Oh, that doesn't work. 
I'm sure it'll work. It, it keep, it keep trying it. Oh wait. I'm sure she'll start. She'll start laughing. I'm sure. Funny story on the r slash Sam and Max Reddit. One, the one mod there went on a power trip. He really hates the Sam and Max ship, so we tried to ban it, saying people need to stop making stuff up and enjoy the games. The entire community there absolutely clowned on him rightfully. Hell yeah. That is literally canon that they're gay. <laughs> it's it's basically canon. You should try shit tickling her again. Does it actually work? I don't know. Keep trying it. I've he never called tried the ship her. sexual deviancy. That man is a pure-blooded Christian. Yeah. No one, no one who is. Look, it worked. Um. What do I do? It scared the shit out of me the first time I saw this. Like you just like sit on the main menu for a while and try to tap. Does anything else happen? Uh, I think that the cabin appears, and then I don't know anything else. Let's wait. We can wait. The whole rest of the stream, instead of like just like. By the way, one of the creators had the two characters. In they did. One they of the really creators like had the two characters in a tux and dress on his own wedding cake. Yeah, it's. It's anything but. It's everything but confirmed. And it's like. Yeah, it's there's the cabin. Yeah, it's, the cabin it's everything but it's... like confirmed in universe, which makes me sad. They are cowards and they won't say it, but they'll hint at it I mean, so much. I mean, they, I mean, they. There was that one like episode of the show where it's like in the intro they straight up had a wedding. They, yeah, but that was like played for a joke. I mean, that a joke or not, it was still like. Yeah, the only thing he said later was Sam should have been in the dress instead. <laughs> Hell yeah. No, I can't see. I can't see Sam in a dress. I can only see Max in it, to be honest. No, Sam in a dress is such a fucking power move. It is, but it's like I cannot physically imagine him in that. I have a lighter that I play with when I'm nervous. How come you're nervous? I was nervous during the the nightmare thing. That's fair. That's what that clicking was when you heard. It was me playing with the lighter. Ah. It's like a Bic lighter, too. It's not even like one of those cool Zippos. Ah, she's back. Like yeah. a... <gasps> Gucci, 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 yeah. Gucci, 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 Tickle, tickle. All right. Quit. And then switch to chatting. Hey, guys. That was a fun stream, right? This might turn into a highlight video, or it might not. Hey, Abby. What's hey, up? I can't wait for the for the sequel to the highlight video, where it's a, it features me this time. <laughs> and everybody hates it because can I have here. the mommy again chat we can't just go back you can put up an image of the here go, go like look one up look <sighs> up the tower look up the tower uh, get, a, get an image of the, the tower the tower slay the princess images oh this one's actually pretty well done I really want her. <laughs> Copy image address. That's the Undertale Yellow OST. Let's let's play this a little bit. Here, we'll have something play in the background while I get this open. Um, add image. Add source. Random images. Add oh God, Mr. Enter jump scare. No. <laughs> get away, Mr. Enter. There we go. Emotionally, physically, mentally, incarnally. Cat, look. Mr. Enter, no. Did you, did you say cat, look? I said chat, look. You said cat. No, I said chat. I'm literally the editor. I'm gonna look back at this and show that it's just cat. watch the VOD. <laughs> god, she is amazing. You need to say tower, she is amazing, because she's god. If God was a woman, would we call her goddess? Or just God? I've seen God. She's black. <laughs> Is that- that's like a shirt, right? I think so. Oh my tower, you are so right. I Here. love whenever- I love, like, the trope in cartoons whenever, like, the God is established and people use the name of it in vain. <laughs> 
Like no, I love that trope, but there's like actual in-universe gods and they actually like reference those gods instead of saying, oh yeah. god, or oh Christ. Jesus Christ! Who? You know? No. no <laughs> Dude, who's, who's Jesus? <laughs> In this world, we, we, uh, we, uh, I don't know. <laughs> Any, like, universe where they say, oh my god, god is like Christianity is kind of... Also, yeah, I've seen bad. God, She's Black is a reference to Thomas Jefferson Miku Binder. What? The fuck is that? None of those I've words are in the of Bible. In my life. <laughs> None of those words are in the Bible. I'm starting to doubt if God is even in the Bible. Uh, let me look this up. Thomas, here we'll we'll look it up together, chat. Oh, we'll get together. We'll look it up. Yeah. I've never heard of fucking Thomas. I'm Jefferson looking it up, guys. Mind. Calm down. Thomas Jefferson Miku Binder. Oh, I know what this is. I know exactly what this fucking is. I I saw this on Twitter once. Where else would I see it? I have a feeling that. Wait, I think I know exactly. You know exactly what, what we're talking about. Uh, open image and new tab. I th I thought that Miku Binder was. Oh. <laughs> Oh, oh. <laughs> Awake ancient memories. Oh, I finally, oh my fucking god! I look at the stream and then I realize, I I realize what like Miku Binder meant, and then I looked over to your stream and I see it. <laughs> I remember this. I remember this, and I'm like, what is this? It's, no. I, I remember how I found out about it. It was like a it's a reference to Hamilton fanfish from all the characters in the high school and also queer. Yeah, that's what it was. There was also the Alexander Hamilton one. Yeah, there's this one. Oh my god, he's so tiny. <laughs> I'm going to bed now. No, hold on. We have to delve deeper. <laughs> no, I gotta go to bed. No, we need to delve deeper. <laughs> <laughs> My mom's gonna shut off the internet if I don't go. <laughs> don't you love when they made the man who raped his slaves black and trans? Oh, yeah. Fuck I don't up. think I can say that on stream. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go to bed. Go to bed. I'm ending stream. <laughs> <laughs> this was an awful place to... This better be in the goddamn highlights. <laughs> <laughs> post credit scene. <laughs> Night. Thomas Jefferson Miku Binder. Best way to end chat. this stream. Good night, chat. I chat. fucking hate you. Chat, chat I hope you all burn in hell. I hope you all die. I hope you all die. Good